I'm here with Disputed. Hello. Hello. Hey. Big day today. Okay, so we this is this is probably the biggest of days, all right? You don't even understand how big of a day this truly is, okay? First of all, first of all, we are doing a Gup beanbag giveaway at the end of the day. So, yeah, hi. If you want a Gup beanbag, stick around. It's going to be fun. There's your chance. Okay, but let's go over what the fuck we're doing today. Um, what kind of loadouts we have, who's playing, all that kind of stuff. So we have eight players today. Do not listen to Cabbage. Um, we have eight players today. We have Cabbage, Waxy, Corny, Disputed, Goji, Dan, Ruddy, did I say Cap? And Cap. So we got quite the fucking lobby, actually. Um, and we're going to do some a bracket style that's like double elimination. So let's go over that right now just so we know what we're looking at before we start. It's a little bit different from all, last time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's look at the website real quick before we look at the bracket. These are the loadouts we're going to see today. Uh, I know you're looking at six loadouts. You're thinking, man, that's a lot. It's going to go a little bit faster. We're going to cut off people uh, after the first two uh, win a little bit. But anyway, that's what we're dealing with. And then the bracket. All right, so we start off with two separate groups, okay? The top two players from each group will enter in the top bracket with Void Fiend. The bottom two players from each group will enter the bottom bracket with Commando. Uh, the winners of the Commando loadout and the losers of the Void Fiend loadout will play Artie. The winners of Void Fiend and the winners of Artie will play together in Captain. We'll go over this a lot today, um, but we're going to start off with Railgunner and Huntress, and it'll make sense as it goes. Uh, this gives everyone the opportunity to play twice, to have comebacks, and all that kind of stuff, and to play with other people as they go around. around. But this is the Gup Cup today, so... This is the big tournament. This is the style. And I want to thank Jones for uh, setting up the tournament style board for us. And obviously Zeo for last minute setting up the uh, all the visual stuff for us today. So we're and ready, I think. Huh? Speed, go. Okay. Be ready. Should I tell him? No, no, no. You're, you're going to say something. What are you going to say? What? Oh, I was just saying, uh, like last time, we have a rotating casting couch here. So I'm actually okay. casting this first loadout. But next loadout I will be playing, and somebody else will be in here, and uh, that's yeah. going to be happening throughout the day. But Race is always going to be here, so... Yeah. If you have I'm a problem, one. yell at him. Yeah, please don't. <laughs> Alright, I think we're ready. You can go say to the guys that we're ready to play, and we're going to start out loadout 1 on Railgunner right now. Okay. So... You're good. We're good, we're ready. You're good to go. You're good to go. Hello? Cabbage? Yeah. You're good to go. Yeah. You're good to go, sir. Alright, thank you, Disputed. Corny, my man, you are good so. to go. Hello? You're good to go. You're good to go, right now? Yes. Yes, okay. There we go. And... All right. We are theoretically in. It's lagging already. Nice. Off to a great start. Someone is lagging. Yeah, it's I'm cabbage. Okay. Excellent start, dude. And there we go. Let's find out. All right. Railgunner is the first one up today. So let's what do you think do this also, loadout? We have a new bingo link. So, hold on. We have a new bingo link, so if you want to get in bingo early, make sure you type in exclamation point bingo, get the new bingo link, and play with everyone else if you want to join the Discord and share your bingo pages in there. there so go. much stuff right, to go what through. What do I think of this loadout? Yeah. Um, no one likes the Polar Mine. Let's just... No, oh, come on. That. Come on. It's better Bubble Shield. Yeah, but that's such a low bar. <laughs> <laughs> it is. We're scraping the ground here, dude. Like, the yeah. The the barrel. You look at a fucking I, ant hill, and it's better than bubble shield. <laughs> Literally um, anything. Yeah. 
I think Polar Field is really, honestly, one of the coolest visual skills in the game. Um, I just think it kind of sucks, so it doesn't like do anything for you that you couldn't have just done by walking away with the other mine or something. I'll say this, I really like it during pizza, like slowing down the orb shots That's fair. while I just deal with dodging the pizza slices. I think that's cool. I also like that the cooldown is pretty low and it has a long uptime, so you can basically always have one up. Mm -hmm. But yeah, sometimes it does hurt you. Like if you're charging the teleporter, it just keeps projectiles on the map longer than they need to be. And you just run into yeah. them. That's kind of horrible. Ar oh, already an ice band for Cap. That is beautiful. I mean, with Railgunner, like, what else do you really need? You know? Also, and we're gonna see a, uh, because we don't have the mine on this one, I mean, we're gonna have to see some interesting strats for pillar skipping, either like a host skip or like a design pillar skip or something mm -hmm. like that. Yeah. And these guys are gonna be going pretty fast today. If you watch the previous tournament, they're kind of incentivized to go slower because it was basically just don't get last. If you got last, you're eliminated. Here, uh, nobody's getting eliminated in this first loadout, but the top two will go to the winner's bracket and third and fourth will go to the loser's bracket. So you really want to go fast and get in those top two spots. So yep. I'm expecting to see some like 30s, maybe 20s on this loadout if they can. Cap really utilizing those pennies well like to see it <laughs> looks like waxy it, found dude. the band as well waxy and cap have the same like build they just have in weird order yeah interesting how they found all the the same chests it looks like um corny's really playing that shrine got a goat hoof out of it too cabbage is already basically done with teleporter he only has like a few percent left on charging that so that is not surprising to see but look at his items yeah I mean, he is going to miss out on the band early here, but, um, I mean, Cabbage just knows how fast he can go on Railgunner, so he's just taking good advantage of that. That's true. He's probably the favored racer, ELO-wise, in this loadout. Mm -hmm. I mean, especially I... for this character. Oh, look know? at this like, crowbar printer. Look Sorry. Look at this Goathoof printer. What is Interesting. Happening? Okay. <laughs> This, that's it. They have crowbars and goat hoof. Stage one railgunner. That's it. Like, <laughs> yeah. Good. That's pretty crazy. And they have a band on the stage as well. Like, just at that point, I would loot up a little bit the stage, get all the crowbars and hooves, and then actually just send it all the way through. Probably. Absolutely. Like, I'd probably go more for goat hooves than crowbars mm -hmm. at this point, because speed is so fucking good. And with Railgunner, crowbars yeah. are really nice, obviously, but if you have an ice band, I don't know. You kind of have damage. Get like maybe one or two. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay. Cap is messing with me a little bit. <laughs> but it looks like everyone's basically doing the same thing. Corny is the only one that has not found the ice band. I really hope he finds it. It's a little bit like he can see it from where he's at if he's not behind this uh, stump. It's that large chest next to the the giant uh, half tree that you walk. Yeah, in. by the fire. Mm -hmm. So hopefully he does. So, did Cabbage get any crowbars here? No, he's just going all into speed. It looks like, and he's keeping an APR. APR. Yeah, which is good, good honestly. honestly. Not even bothering with the blue be. portal, just going to the next stage. Probably smart. I mean, you can I, I, get anything there anyway. Yeah, you know, you're gonna go like like other like, like, and then like giving them that resource for it. it. It's kind it's of kind of brutal. I don't know, I don't know. And cabbage is the first one on stage two. Unsurprisingly. Surprise. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what is that? Ignition tank printer. I mean, if it was on another loadout, maybe I would hey, for it, but... I would probably... Yeah. All they have is... Oh, they have an ice band. Never mind. Yeah. They're not yeah, you can't, <laughs> you can't get rid of that. There's yeah, a scrapper, was, though, like, maybe. I would give up both of them real quick, but... 
don't know. 50 50 it? For uh, literally no benefit? <laughs> no. Void Cradle looks like Gabbage problem. is not hitting it. Might be waiting until after the telly. Uh, he did not get the healing drone on the last stage. It looks like Ooh. most everybody else did. Cabbage is the only Printer one. As well, which is interesting. He might. There's a scrapper right next to it. I would probably encourage the racers to at least get one key here. Um, like, not from the items they have right now, but like maybe they get a white item they don't really want on the stage. Just scrap print. Well, the keys have just been so. Cabbage good. just got a crowbar, <laughs> so. Yeah. He didn't print any last stage, but he's not really being punished. No. Okay, Corny did get the ice band, so that is really good. It looks like Corny is also going to check the blue portal as well. So we'll get to see what's in there as the first one. Interesting. Probably can't buy anything, but maybe he can cycle it a little bit. But if there's something really good in there... Oh, he's just cycling. He's not even checking. Oh, interesting. He's saying like, okay, you know what? I'm just going to take the, the time loss here and just try to go further with that see if i can get something later that the other racers do not have which is, which is interesting interesting play it could bite him in the ass but it could equally help him too mm -hmm. uh-oh why is everything happening bad to me today i'm i'm locked Video buffering? Yeah, Cap, you are fucking buffering. Alright, we're back. Jesus. Cabbage are there two starting the on the site? Where is Sol? Oh. <laughs> Why did Dan fuck up again? Because oh. Dan is just that good. Great. He gets to play twice. Oh, plasma shrimp on Corny in that void cradle. Ooh, that is so good. The, the damage that they're all getting with this Rogue and Arletta is so just free, honestly. Yeah, they and have they the also damage. they have the movement for it, too. So. Oh, gasoline. Now? Don't. So that ignition <laughs> tank. It's They don't even need it, though. It's bait. Like, they're, like they're real gunner. They can already kill like everything anyway. I mean, yeah, it's I still mean, nice to have a bit of AoE, though. I mean, it's nice, but they already have the gas. I don't know. I don't think they go across the stage to scrap and then go across the stage again I, to print. Okay, so I think for Waxy, that might be a bad play, but for someone like Cabbage, who has a bunch of speed, is not going to be that big of a time loss. And stage 5 teleporter, like you don't want to be in a position where you have to kite and have to like move in and out of it. Gasoline ignition tank will help you so much just staying in the teleporter. Because like right now, they can one-shot everything, basically. But once it gets to stage 4 and 5, you can one-shot everything still, but there's going to be things spawning in really fast, and it helps to have a little bit of that AoE to kind of get you through. I just don't think Cabbage would do it. Uh, Probably it not. how long it takes. Because it could take a while. Is it worth a minute, potentially? I don't know. It's a good question. Yeah. But it's definitely the safer strat, I would say. I think your chances of dying doing that are a lot lower. I bet you Cap oh, will do it, though. if you're worried about dying, then yeah. But I don't think Cabbage is. Cap That's has four speed I mean, like, here. There's a watch as well. Their damage multiplication is crazy, dude. They have AP round, crowbar, uh, watch, plasma shrimp, band, like... Yeah, so, like they're getting a little bit of everything. Plus, they have crit because they're real gunner, obviously. So, so I noticed uh, Cap and Cabbage mainly went into speed on the last stage, but Waxy went basically all into crowbars. And I can't tell what Corny has. Corny has two goat hooves and two crowbars. Okay, so it looks like he went half and half, basically. Mm hmm. I don't know. I don't know what the play is there. I think probably going into speed more is better. Especially with the Plasma Shrimp Ice Band. Like, they have damage. It's not a problem. Another watch for Cabbage. Goodness gracious. And Cap and Cabbage are on stage three. 
Void Cradle here. It looks like Cabbage did pick up a healing drone on the last stage. He's also using that Caffeinator to kind of heal up here so he can get that Void Cradle. Arch is smart. I don't, we don't really see that being used that often for that. Like, usually people look at it as like, oh, it's either a damage equipment or I don't pick it up because I don't have the damage with yeah. it. But it actually, like, it does heal you, you know, so. It's just not, like, super reliable. It's not like Wood Sprite or a Dole where you can just activate it and be good. Mm -hmm. But it is definitely healing. Um, and they do have that healing drone. Healing drones are so important in the races. I, in fact, I think oh, healing yeah. drones are priority over items a lot of the time. I think it's better than an item, usually. Uh -huh. Like, the average item is worse than a healing drone stage one. Yeah, and it distracts enemies sometimes, too. They have a hard time hitting it. Mm -hmm. The only problem is they kind of die in the late game. Yeah. Especially so, on stage yeah, but five. By then you have, you should have some items, right? So Hopefully. Can, like, make up for it. But, like, it will carry really pretty well. Mm-hmm. I mean, it, like, if you don't have any healing, healing drones will get you by throughout the entire run. You might mm -hmm. have to spend some extra money on them, rebuying them. Cabbage oh, already cabbage. on the teleporter. Uh-oh. Okay, okay, we're, we're good. Cabbage almost got blasted off the map and hosted, but the uh, ground at that point is just so... Okay, well, oh, Cap also it. hit the teleporter and he's struggling. A fire band teleporter item, okay. Ew. But Cap broke his what watch. What is with the runs recently? <laughs> it's crazy. Oh, Cap broke his watch. Yeah, he was struggling at no. the same time Cabbage was. Okay, well, at least it's not a plus five, honestly. That's true. It's it's, it's one watch. And with the second band here, he should be okay. But it does give Cabbage a pretty big advantage. He has 40% more damage because of those. It's going to be a 40% faster fight, 40% easier time dealing with enemies. It adds up. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Not exactly 40% faster fight, but roughly. It's roughly. And that's the thing, like, it might take you a bit to, like, go and grab that armor piercing round on the edge of the map, but will that save you time during Mythrix? Will it save enough time? It's hard to say. Like, it depends on the run, obviously, but, like, you know, if you're commando or something, usually or probably would if you know that it's like one of those damage items or something, stuff like that. I think it's decisions like that that make the races so interesting to watch. Oh, yeah. Dude. There's so much that goes into it. And it's not just like pure speed running where it's the fastest person to get through it. It's the decisions you make along the way. And one person can go slower um, for most of the race, but then rush ahead at the last second and still get the win so just because cabbage is the only one on stage four right now doesn't mean he can't get last place and the others will catch up mm -hmm. you also see different strategies like some people like to rush the first couple stages and then heavily loot four and five because that's where most items are and then some people like to do the opposite and really loot the early stages and kind of ignore the later ones Yeah, like... I think as time kind of goes on, I kind of like the idea of looting the early stages a little bit more than the later ones. Yeah, I think it makes sense. Because, like, I feel like a lot of racers, they try to go too fast early on, and then that's where a lot of just early deaths happen, or that's where a lot of, like, just situations where you're relying a little bit on RNG right out the gate kind of come in, um, where... You, instead you could just get a few things early and then kind of know where you're at and kind of gauge how fast you can go from there I yeah like that a little bit more that, that's definitely my issue i tend to go really quick in the early stages but if you think about the way the scaling works where it's easy and then it'll ramp up and then it just gets exponentially harder getting items early on is definitely the play so you don't fall into a situation where you snowball your run And it looks like Cap is just leaving right now. I mean, obviously, Cabbage is done and going to stage five. Wow. <laughs> but 
Yeah, he had a quick stage, dude. Cap went back to the other side and grabbed another watch, which is basically the situation we were just talking about. Like, is it worth it to do mm -hmm. that? I think for real gunner, maybe. I don't know because like it. Hmm. It depends how many other sources of damage you have, right? Because with Railgunner right now, they have the band, they have the AP round, the crowbar, uh, the other band. Um, the watch isn't just multiplying Railgunner's base damage. It's multiplying all of those items too. But then you have to kind of weigh, okay, but Railgunner kills Mythic so fast, will it actually even save the amount of time it took me to go get the watch? Yeah. There's so much to even think about it. If you're one-shotting everything anyway, a little bit more damage isn't going to make a big difference. Yeah. Opal Printer. I think it's smart to grab one or two of those when you don't have a feather. Oh, absolutely. I mean, yeah. Getting slapped by Mythrix and not losing all of your health is great. <laughs> and, and Cabbage is just going. Already killed the stage 5 boss. Mm -hmm. Um... Does he have a pillar skip? Oh, plus five for Oh, cat. no. I didn't look. Was it a larva? I think it might have been. I don't know. I'm not sure. Maybe that or a, uh, a golem shot. I was looking Blazing at Blazing larva? Yeah. That'll do it. Well, that does not put him in a good position because he was ahead, but he kind of slowed down on the last stage, and Corny and Waxy are right there. I would... It's not like for sure though, right? I just want to remind chat of that. Like, even though it's not good to plus five, um, I mean, this is still a loadout that a lot of these guys are a little bit uncomfortable with. A lot of people really rely on the mines, the movement mines with Drill Gunner. So the polar mines kind of a little bit of a switch up, you know? It is. Oh, Waxy oh, plus and five as well. Oh, a plus five for Waxy. See, right, right there. It happens. So if Corny can just play this out, I, I think he's looking good. Cabbage, I imagine, will not plus five. I mean, you never know. But I think at this point, if these guys just play it safe, uh-oh, Corny looks like he's struggling. The caster curse. Mm. Oh, those larvae are harassing him. I need a... Talk to Nightbot about deleting people's messages in chat right now. <laughs> Is Nightbot doing a 1984 cosplay? Yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry, chat. And Cabbage is on the moon. He does not have a pillar skip, I don't think. Maybe there's a way you can do it. And we'll see. If, if anybody is, can, it's Cabbage, it. yeah. You might just do pillars though. Like the time you take looking for a pillar skip is oftentimes more detrimental than just doing pillars and taking right, the time loss. That. Yeah. Like if you don't know what the pillar skip is, right? And you're just like trying and like going up and down for like five minutes, it's like you could have just been on the fight by that point. Dude. And especially when you have a lot of speed. Like one of the reasons pillars are so time consuming is just the time it takes to travel to them right yeah it's so long and the cabbage doesn't have a ton of speed but he does have a little bit which is another decision like from stage one that is paying off right now and i think getting that speed was definitely the play i think waxy may have plus five there just because he's having trouble dodging stuff which makes sense mm -hmm. if you don't have speed of course you're gonna have trouble uh, so I think he went into damage a little bit too much there. Yeah, the one hoof on his end is a little bit rough, honestly. Mm -hmm. And Corny is, looks like he's going to get out of here without a plus five. I hope so. Puts him in a really good spot. All these guys are on stage four and Cabbage is on the moon. It's insane to see. I know. No saver spaces, unfortunately, which just means no free host skips, so... Maybe there's a headset. I mean, if there is a headset, would you even want it? No, I don't want to lose my two bands. Honestly, yeah. I'll just do the fight. 
Which, I mean, it would save me some time doing pillars, but like, I don't know. Did Cabbage do this Void Seed? I don't think he did. I think he just went straight to the teleporter and pieced out as soon as he could. Yeah, I think he just went. Yep. I, I don't even think he left the Void Seed once. Cab taking the Lysate cell. Not the Void Seed teleporter, sorry. Yeah, Lysate with this build is actually really good. It um, is. Obviously, what he's kind of thinking at this point, he's like thinking, okay, I don't really want to look for too much equipment. There's only like one equipment, I think, that needs a fuel cell to skip anyway and it's like the chance of him finding a fuel cell and that equipment are really low uh and you can just freeze mythrix over and over again with this one so it's all good corny took void crit interesting well i don't think that's necessarily that bad here yeah. i just don't think it really helps either um, it's not a big a deal either way regular run i like to not take it because i like scrapping a lot right and if i pick up a lot of crit just by chance. I don't get to scrap that for stuff that I want, let's say. But they're not going to be really scrapping in yeah. this either. They're just going to be getting what they get and go. So I think it depends fine. on the survivor, but in the races, Void Crit has definitely saved me more than a few times, especially yeah. on the really cope loadouts. Um, but obviously, Everybody it's very survivor dependent. Guys. Like It's going to be better on Commando than Artie, for example. Yeah. Cabbage is struggling with this one exploder okay he's finally got it jesus that's why i like having the the polar field though like he could be setting that down and be helping him a little bit oh waxy got blasted up in the air it looks like he's fine no he's not fine oh <laughs> if you used your charge shot there could you have canceled all of the fall damage probably more than he canceled maybe i don't know it's a tough spot because it takes so long to charge Oof. That was a tough one, though. Hmm. Yeah. <sighs> and Cabbage is that done is with red. pillars. That is a Shattering Justice on Waxy. No one else has that one. Well, interesting. And with the DML, you can kind of yeah. get some utilization out of that. With Railgunner, it's kind of I mean, hard actually... to, to use it. You have to use your SMG and then shoot him. And on Mithrix, that just takes too much time. By the time you get your Shustus up, he's going to dash out of it. I think they have potential to actually proc it if he's far away because they have Plasma Shroom. But it's still oh, not going to that much for them right now. And here we go. Cabbage is starting the fight. Let's see how his fight goes. Pretty fast, I imagine. His initial damage. Yeah, I just want to see, like, the chunk, you know. Setting up the polar field. In. Honestly, pretty good chunk. And also with this uh, this special, Mythrix has a third less HP. So that was like half HP to Mythrix right there, pretty much. So you have to execute. I don't I don't know what Hopu was thinking. They're like, okay, we're going to give this character <laughs> an insane damage and a 30% execute on Mythrix. Yeah, and some people still think this special is terrible. <laughs> so, I mean, maybe they knew what they were thinking. Oh. Not to mention, it has a 1.5 proc coefficient. Okay. First phase done. Yeah, why not? Fucking more. More damage. So, this is going to be really quick. This is where the crowbars really help. Like, taking out these wisps in as few shots as possible. It's kind of the limiting mm -hmm. factor in this phase. And this is going to be a really quick run from Cabbage. Yep. And so, reminder, we... Well... I guess on the first two loadouts of the day, we can have everyone play it through. But on the other ones, um, or on loadouts three, four, and five, we're going to speed up a little bit. Well, and so once the first two people win, we'll move on to the next one. So here's the thing. Well, well, because Cap and Waxy have plus fives, it looks like Cap might finish first, but it looks like Corny will probably get a faster real time. Corny just picked up a, another Firebrand, by the way, too. Yeah, I mean, we'll, we'll have to, like, actually see, you know, but... Cabbage is almost done here. I imagine he's going to go for a phase four skip. He usually I does. I imagine so. Yeah, I think he's holding off on hitting him okay. here. No, nope. he's just... Never mind. He's just going to go. A real gunner is so quick phase four, it's okay. I mean, him having to wait until Mythics jumped again and doing phase four is probably the same amount of time for real gunner, so... 
So okay, there's no like saber spaces blocking a shot either. It's just it's over already. Mm-hmm. There you go. Yeah. And cabbage already doing it. Eat. So I think it's safe to say cabbage has secured a spot here. Oh yeah, he's not a big he's surprise. His spot in the winner's bracket. I mean, we gave him Railgunner first, so. I'm just, just happy play. I was not in a bracket with this man. <laughs> But uh, I think I'm looking at Corny here for second place. I mean, he does not have a plus five, and that is a huge factor here. But neither has he left the stage yet. So That's true. Cap could catch up here. It just depends, because, like, if you're in this loadout, it might be easy to say, like, oh, maybe I, I could find a feather, or maybe I could find that POTA skip, or maybe I can just, like, I'm on the stage a little bit longer, let's just kind of see. Yeah. Um, I mean, it looks like he's walking around a little bit, too. He's looting more. So, yeah, I don't know. It's, and I don't know how much time he's going to spend on that, but he might spend a lot of time, and then by that time, pillars are a little bit harder, and then he has a tougher time, and then yada, 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 so. I want to see him leave as soon as he hits this shrine. There's nothing he can really get that will help him that much. Maybe go into the opal printer, but Ooh. besides that... Poly loot for cap? Yeah. Yeah. Oof. Corny, you so, gotta go, my man. Yeah, and I, <laughs> but Corny also does have that key. So if he does go to Blood Pillars, then he should be able to find the poly loot as well. It's like right on the path to them. Very hard to miss. That's you're going the wrong way. <laughs> Corny. <laughs> Please. So what is Cap looking for at uh, soup here? I think he's looking for soup, but oh, the stompers. There's headset. Ooh, okay. Interesting. And he does I mean, have a poly loot, so if he loses his bands, I... it's like he'll still have some damage. Mm -hmm. Looks like he's choosing to do pillars anyway, though. Which is, I think, the right call. But um, yeah. Let's bring Cabbage in here right now. Hello, Cabbage. Hey. You lost. Oh, man. Yeah. Tough. Oh, they're fine <laughs> No, you're fine. Um, I mean, it was it was an easy real gunner loadout. You guys had all the damage and movement at the start, and then it just kept giving you more, so. <laughs> I didn't have movement. There was a speed printer stage one. Yeah, yeah. yeah I had that, but not more after. Oh, I, I guess so. It didn't really give you more. Some oh, of the yeah. others stayed a little bit stage one just to get some extra movement and then Yeah, I was hoping for a phase. I just thought, you know, usually there's a phase. Mm -hmm. You know, like, something like 99% of run from a phase. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. Interesting that you elected to do the blood shrines and Cabbage is doing the jumpy shrines right now. Blood Cap shrine? Uh-oh, Cap! 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 Uh-oh. He got knocked off by the design pillar. Oh, <laughs> no. Oh. Okay, Corny looking a little better here. Corny's looking a lot better. Hey, Cabbage, I hear you typing in my ear. <laughs> uh, uh, that was funny to some kind of chat. <laughs> oh, dude. Corny is still I mean, on stage five. Dude, that's what I'm saying. I knew he would stay a little bit longer. All right, can I end stream? No. <laughs> I mean, I mean, just, I'll keep stream up. I think. Oh, he's scrapping. Okay, if he gets enough for a headset here, he doesn't have to he, do pillars. He might, actually. Yeah, he has Gome, Deathmark, and Baldrin, which are all, like, unusable in Mythrix, so. Yeah. Okay, we could see this pay off for him. Yeah, it still would have been faster. Replacement for pillars right now. It would have been faster for him to do pillars had he just left after he did teleporter, but he'll uh, he'll basically be similar real time with Cap if he can just go get headset. Well, probably not because Cap is starting the fight. He'll probably be done, but Corny should be good. He doesn't have any plus fives. Waxy is on the moon now. Waxy has two plus five, same amount as Cap. He, Waxy actually got a Scorpion. I completely missed that.
I didn't even know that either. But Waxy has two plus fives as well. If this goes bad for Cap, Waxy could potentially also get second place. I, I think it would require Corny to also die a few times, but it is Mythrix. And people have been known to die there. I don't have a lot of speed, or not all of them, so... I mean, it's... They could take a slap or something. I mean, pizza always happens, you know? Mm-hmm. I wonder if they're going to find the poly loot here. It looks like they both have keys. But I don't know if Waxy opened the one on the last stage. Mm. It depends where he picked it up, I guess. But they should all find where the key box is. I think. I mean, it actually depends. Because, like, if you're going to blood, you'll find it. If you're not at all, and you're just going straight to soup on the left side, you probably won't find it. So, Corny might not get the poly loot. Hmm. I don't know. They have a lot of perfects to deal with here. I think it's kind of a consequence yeah. of getting here later. Correct. Why are they here later? Good question. Not as confident. Ooh. I think a lot of people have been uh, playing returns this week, so um, I, I think there are a few people in here, myself included, that are a little bit rusty. Excuses already? Jesus. <laughs> yeah. I, played yet. I mean, I wasn't going to say it, but yeah. <laughs> no, it, it's totally fair, though. I mean, I haven't even played the game in like two weeks, so. Yeah. I've been Same. stuck in, in the returns. The returns pit. Cap looks like he's almost done. Is he going to set yeah, up for a phase just... four skip? Probably not. Oh no, it's actually, uh, he has to wait a little bit. Yeah, he doesn't have bands up. He could freeze right now and he'll do pizza in the center. Oh yeah, and he has a lysate cell, so he can just get another one up. Oh, there he goes. Got it. Nice. With the Cap is done. He does have those two plus fives though, which... Oh yeah, we'll Cabbage, we, we noticed you didn't phase four skip. You just decided to kill Mithrix. Uh, I think it was yeah. like faster or the same amount of speed. I'm pretty I mean... sure. He was just not stopping with the pizza, uh, like, like I froze him like after the second pizza, he did like five more, it's like, I don't know, mm. kind of rough, I just wanted it to be over. Makes sense. And Cap is done. Unfortunately, he does have two plus fives. So, why is that? Larva uh. and a design pillar pushed him off the stage. Oh. Yeah, it's a new one. I almost went off the stage. Well, I did go off the stage. I didn't die, though. That was nice. Did you have Corny. any opals? No. Okay. Corny is traversing this map very slowly. He is focusing on the ads, and I don't think he needs to. Nah, he just needs to go. I know there's, like, a perfected somewhere in the air around him that he's, like, a little bit scared of, but... Okay. He's got yeah, it now, though. Like... Stand on the bubble and just clear all those guys before you go any further. Like, yeah, I the think bubble, I mean, the rail gunner, right? This, like, wall section here is kind of bait because they, like, fly around it really quick and you don't really see where they are all the time. And then, like, yeah. like, the bubble, you have so much visibility. I mean, so, it's just RNG. There wasn't any bait. Corny has 10 minutes to do pillars and kill Mothrix, which should be possible with Railgunner, yeah, but. It's very possible, yeah. But, I mean, at his pace. I mean, up here, too. Yeah, and he has enough scrap. Looks like but it. Does he know the host with head stompers? Oh, he has oh, to. In the suit. Oh, why did I go there? I I mean I don't even think it would have been good. Uh, no, no, it been I mean I think Cap saw it and he didn't grab it either. All right, should we bring Cap in here? Yeah. Murder again. Hey, Cap. Hey. 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 How do you so feel about that one? That was your first uh, loadout. Uh, real time was okay, but there were a couple of throws, of course. So. Uh huh. We'll see. Um, the stage four larva death. Obviously, everyone saw it. I'm sure. <laughs> I, I, I mean, I tried to run away. I didn't have the mobility mines, so. You have a polar field. Did you try that one. 
Yeah, it doesn't do anything actually, which is it's kind of weird. Maybe it's bugged oh, or right. something, but okay. yeah, strange. <laughs> but yeah, and then of course the classic uh, charging the design pillar while you're in between the pillar and the cliff is not the brightest idea. Yeah, so that uh, that one really cost you. <laughs> yeah, hurt my heart when I saw you fall. Like there was that moment where you just knew you couldn't get back on land, and you're like, oh. Yeah, it was. <laughs> I was hoping for either there's a frame perfect. If you use Railgunner's primary downwards, that you don't take any fall damage at all. So I was either playing, praying for that or my double Teddy proccing. So that was just all I had going for me, unfortunately. Or so, might be baited into getting the Yeah, I know. Here, he, he didn't take it. He didn't take it. The Clover. Does There's he clover. see it? It's in the corner on the outside. You didn't oh, okay. Trade. There was the Stompers. The Stompers, yeah. I was... He sees them. I wanted to take it so bad, but I don't know. You, I think no you made the right call. Up. No, because yeah. like know. he died of fall damage right afterward, <laughs> so he did. Yeah, that is true. I mean, but <laughs> if like, gambled to keep a band, it still uh -oh. would have been good. Oh, dude, Waxy almost did exactly what you did, Cap. <laughs> that was really <laughs> scary. Well, I don't know. Designed. I feel like it might be kind of close. Corny's been playing I... really slow. Mm -hmm. We'll see. Let me pull up the stream. See how no, I... did he saw so much time actually yes seven oh. minutes one of those yeah. minutes you have to charge the ship though where is corny going he, he's gonna do the skip right now yeah but he could just jump down right now he doesn't know that why it's does fun. he not know that <laughs> i don't know Man. <laughs> this is the for safer spaces you do need to be all the way up there but with headset you can no, jump you from you wherever do no do you not you don't have to be all the way up there i feel like corny. it helps it does, uh, yeah, sure. Corny. He's gonna have to go again, unfortunately. Oh, he hit the lip. Ugh. He hit the lip. Uh oh. Oh, he's he, gonna he reset. He is bleeding Ooh. time. He's gonna go to the other spot that he knows better, uh -huh. I believe. Oh, no. Mm. This, yeah, this is bad. All right. We Good need for some, me. We need some boot camp <laughs> on this kind of Shut stuff. Shut up. <laughs> what? Hey, I'm trying to help. What do you mean? This is great for me. I'm <laughs> loving this. <laughs> Right. I mean, I said it was bad. Suffer, but... corny. Oh man. What yeah, you can keep is... failing the pillar skip. That's fine. <laughs> this is what happens when you have casters uh... in who are also playing next round. Like... <laughs> yeah. What are you trying to say? Um... You, you're trying to say I'm biased? No, of course not. But look at this. I mean, by the time that corny spent like going all the way through the stage, back up, back down. I mean, Waxy's already done with pillars, and he's going up right now. So he might he's still chilling. get ahead of uh, of Corny here. Oh no, he sells the two plus fives. Never mind. Never mind. So why does everyone loop so much? I see a lot of loot. No, oh, Corny. Corny. I think you're I mean, probably a... the most confident railgunner gauntlet racer. Look at the rock. Okay, he got it. He got it. Okay. He's got a hit no, with the Railgunner rail overall just have a bunch of damage, and we got like damage early on. Yeah. I mean, I I spent a good amount of time on stage one just because of the hoof burner. I wanted to make sure I had guaranteed speed, and it still didn't help because I died to larva. So, yeah. Okay. I want to see a fast fight from Corny here. It should be really fast. He has Polyloot Plasma Shrimp, two watches, bands. And he has a few minutes. Oh, that was another Basically, thing. So many chances for a safer spaces, and we just never found one. Nope. So painful. Yeah, Cabbage didn't even one, loot just, the seeds. Just RNG. Yeah, if there was safer spaces or a base, I would have just lost. Yeah. I just got That's RNG the thing. Like, you can gamble for just going fast. Yeah. And it pays yeah. off. I mean, the, the, time. the time it took you guys to clear the seeds is basically the time yeah. it took him to do pillars. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. So I, I even RNG called period. it. Like, I was on stage three, and I was like, Cabbage is probably on stage five right now. <laughs> But it was. <laughs> yep. Yeah. <laughs> I knew it. Because it, it's That's totally it. possible with this loadout. It's all and the items we were given. All RNG. It definitely helps. Yeah. So Corny Fine, has Corny. five minutes to end his run. That's... Yeah. One and of those minutes in the winners you bracket. have to charge ship. So he has to beat Mithrax in yeah. four minutes. I can go it's tell possible. Him oh, yeah, go sorry. tell him. <laughs> All right, give him yeah, insider him, info. Yeah, just make him really like nervous, just for no yeah, really reason. Really right? conscious <laughs> about what needs to be done. <laughs> you need to do it right now. Oh, you're failing. Oh, you're doing it wrong. Oh, uh, 
Yeah. It's like <laughs> in his ear. Just... <laughs> this scorpion's oh, kind of popping off for Waxy. Yeah, oh, I don't even know where he found that. I think that was Cauldrons as well. I mean, I think it could have been also in Cauldrons, but... I guess it it was? I don't know. I don't remember. I'm surprised he took that, though, if, if he did find it in Cauldrons. There was way other yeah. stuff and he would have taken. Since there was the Stompers. And the Clover. Yeah. With the Scorpion? Yeah, where did he find it? It was Stage 5. He had that oh, when he oh, okay. was getting to the moon. He found nice. Justice and Scorpion in Stage 5, actually. Oh, shit. <laughs> well, we're in Justice because well, it's useless now. Yeah. yeah. Well, if he had Death Mark still. <laughs> yeah. He maybe could have gone a few procs. You get the uh, the slow debuff from your polar field as well. Right. If you're one shotting everything. That's why I wait for my two watches and then end up just one watch because it's like I only need one one. Yeah, yeah. I need more Firework printer on stage three. Yeah, I was gonna do that as rail gunner, but I realized. And there we go. Okay, he got the skip. Four skip. Four skip. And all he needs to do is walk to the ship and then charge yeah. it, and then he should be fine. Don't take Waxy a bad is portal. As well. Do not take Where a bad portal. Going? Okay. <laughs> how much? How many hooves does he have? It's covered up on the cast. Uh, I'm sorry one. about that. I can't fix it right now. Can you fix it, it right now? Yeah, we got you. All right. This is going to be close. I think, I think he, he should. should. Do winner's bracket, though. Yeah. I think he should. Yeah. Nice. Despite hey, his I best mean, efforts. Consistent. Do you have a stop there? Oh, he's just... Uh -huh. Oh, he's safe. Yeah, yeah. Never mind. You were like, what the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> I was a bit, uh, a bit confused. Good shit, Corny. Yeah. It's going to beat you by about awesome. a minute. Yeah. Yeah, how do you feel, Cap? Uh, I it, mean, real time, I did pretty good. You should so, be ashamed. Yeah, I put it disputed in the loser's bracket, dude. Oh, come on now. Yeah, oh, God. <laughs> I have Dan in my bracket. Don't forget. <laughs> oh, true. Yeah, you'll be fine. I have multiple Australians in my bracket. That's unfortunate. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> We're giving away a gup, so type exclamation point gup in the chat. Shut the hell up. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! Yeah, we'll give it away at the end of the stream, Chad. Don't worry. You'll get your chance. Well done from Corny. And nobody's out. Yeah, that's okay. Um, mm -hmm. Cap and Waxy will just be in the loser's bracket, and they will have another chance to redeem themselves. Yeah, you'll see them in yeah. like two loadouts from now, I think. We're going to do the winner's bracket first and then losers. So. so you guys got me casting for the next two loadouts. Oh, Yay. Uh... Yay. No one said yet. Yeah, <laughs> I, I, I... <laughs> what up, Corny and Waxy? Hello. Yo. What up? So, um... Tell us a little bit about your run. <laughs> what the fuck is that 28 there? God damn. What, yeah. you <laughs> what did you think? Mean? Just cabbage things, yeah. That's 10 uh, points. The run? Yeah. The run, the run was very funky. A uh, little bit of up and down. I'm feeling like really, really sloppy on some executions and some stuff. But... With those minds, you kind of got to, you know, I, so I really went for the slow start, tried to accelerate. It was very sluggish because only two goat hooves, apparently. Yeah. Yeah. Once I got the first band, I was like, and, and the watches, I was just like, okay, we got to go. And I was just going and going. And then 
the the two plus fives that I had were just it, it grinds me so much <laughs> on those plus fives. I just that's all I can say. Oh, you would have had it, bro. Holy, <laughs> holy waxy. God damn, bro. Oh man. Yeah. I mean, what else can we say? Did everybody go for the? How, like, did it? Did everybody go for the stompers in some way, shape, or form? Okay. No. 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 Just there you. was a stompers again, <laughs> and I missed in the it cauldrons. again. The and the the oh. Yeah. Yeah. I but miss every stomper, dude. It's it's a scary one to pick up though, because like you had the three bands, and yeah. you would have had a pillar skip, but you wouldn't have been able to really use stompers during the fight. Yeah. So it's like. like I I scrapped. I tried. How did you guys? How did people skip? Or were there no skips? Like uh, you charge from pillars and then you go up. Yeah, yeah. If you charge the two pillars to 100, percent you actually <laughs> get sent up. So. What? New tech. New what? tech discovery. Yeah, yeah. We get a video about it soon. 100 yeah. percent consistent <laughs> pillar skip. Yo, just do that. They're like spamming you in chat. Yeah, your your audio is fucked. Yeah. I guess. Oh, is it? I don't think they're gonna stop spamming. It's fine I tell you, through so. us, so. Might be just your stream. My bad. Yeah, they're not too hard. Going into oh. like being against cabbage and cap. As soon as I lost that first plus five, I was like, okay, well. <laughs> yeah, don't worry about much it. I plus five on, on stage shit. four to the blazing uh, larva. Oh, I almost did that. Oh, really? yeah, yeah, I almost did that. Got down then, to 70 health. And then on the moon, please never do this, anyone. Do not charge design pillars with you in between the cliff and the pillar. Yeah. Did you fall? I almost you. fell off. I almost <laughs> yeah, that, fell off. You I did, off. I saw I that. Fell off. Yeah. Is it good though? <laughs> oh, no. Chat. How's my audio? Can I fix it? Sounds good in Discord. Mm. Okay. Sounded like my headset after I dropped it. Oh, damn. <laughs> <laughs> They're telling me it's fine. This ain't is better. I think we're good. Okay. We had GG's Corny and Cabbage. The GG. winner bracket. Wow. Congrats. I'll see, I'll see you, Jen. Big clap. Yeah. Good luck. Yeah, I'll see you in the finals. So. I'll see you in the finals, brother. Right. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think we're just going right. to set up the next bracket then. I try to get everyone am... in there. Yes. Oh, we have everyone yeah. but disputed, which is fine. All ready to go. Dope. I have to do some back end stuff for a second, so. In the meantime, Cabbage. Chat. Yeah. Oh, no, you go. You go. Yeah, I'm curious. I'm really curious. Like, out of the items that I picked up, because this is this is meta, you know? Like, out of the items that I am about to tell you, what did you have any way, shape, or form? Did you get a goat hoof? You did get go goat hoof, right? Three of them on stage one. Oh, okay, then a crowbar, the, the ice band drop, beautiful. I mean, yeah, yeah. No. he just went fast. I just walked. Yeah. See, yeah, I was yeah. debating on getting the goat hooves or the crowbars, and I went for the crowbars. I, I At the end of the, the stage one, I was like, fuck, I probably should have just got the fucking goat hooves. That's like, fine I'm a with a good mind. Corny. Good mind you yeah. can do that. You need to watch this yeah. run back because you're on really good pace, but on stage five, you spent like 10 extra minutes looting and like scrapping. And you were basically at the same point as Cap, but he just went really, he was like 10 minutes faster. I was already two yeah. pl plus fives in and I was like, fuck, I mean, I need to see if I can at least get some kind of movement or something. So I just kind of, yeah. I don't know. Yeah. But maybe, like, that's the thing, you know, we, we underestimate the, the time sometimes that it takes to simply charge two pillars and go, you know? Yeah. Um, yeah. De definitely, definitely a mindset that could have set up with more speed beforehand, but I, I really spent 10 minutes to scrap and look for a skip, you know? I did. Yeah. That's, that's also why I stayed around looking for some sort of skip, but yeah. there, was, there was hardly any equipment that I found or anything. anything. Lock boxes, void lock boxes. Oh, no, that's a waste of time. <laughs> I, was, yeah. I was trying to find them to see if we could find if I could find a fucking the spaces, uh, safer spaces. Yeah, that's what I was looking for too. There was a poly loot, and what was the other key box? It was Lice uh, Lice 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 Band void scent. All right, yeah. all right, all right, all right. Uh, we're ready for the second loadout with Dan, Goji, Disputed, and Ready. So.
Ooh. Speed it if you're ready. Um, <laughs> go in your ready. cell. Okay. Into the yeah. dungeon. And the rest of you guys, cabbage. Uh, All right, I'm, I'm sorry about the audio, guys. Looks like it's fixed again, I hope. Uh, oh, shit. Uh, I'm not playing Risk of Rune Returns. Risk of Rune 2. There we go. Okay. Sorry about that. I hope the audio was not fucked up for long. Um, but hopefully we're good now. I will not have chat up. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> Hold on. One second. Let me. I, I'm not gonna be able to look at chat throughout this entire run. So yell at the casters. Hey, we good? Yeah, we're ready to go. Good luck. Okay, thank you. Um. Okay, let me get a screenshot of these loadouts very quickly okay so we got default huntress here um with flurry interesting not sure how i feel about this arrow rain is kind of ass but we'll have to make it work Ugh. This is like one of the lowest DPS in the entire game. I shouldn't have picked that up. Okay, I need to look for a scrapper. I don't want to like instantly break this watch. And I guess it is damage, but I should look for healing. If I want to save it. Because default healing is not going to do that much for me. Let's see if there's a healing drone somewhere. A lot of chests here. I might just want to like kind of try to full loot this map. What is this? Stun grenade? Oh boy. Okay. Give me some heals. Okay, that is good. I'm gonna try to use that right now. I want to find some economy items so I can loot up as much as possible. Okay. Uh oh. Don't get hit by those. That's bad. Alright, just heal up a bit. All right, let's see what we got over here. Ukulele, that's good. It's really good. Um, okay, what do we have back here? A lot of large chests, it seems like. Just want to make sure I'm healing up as much as possible. Um, and I am going for... Hmm. There's a Void Cradle there. I want to see if I can find... Some drones. I think there were some Gunner drones. Up here. There's a Void Cradle. Okay. Uh, maybe I just farm for this large chest, and then I hit TP. I'm kind of nervous about this teleporter. Whip, okay. We'll hit it. Hmm, that's what I didn't want to happen. We're fine. I might. I need to stay in the teleporter as much as possible here. Just get nervous.
Come on, just take him out. Okay, you should die. Ow. Oh, this is going to be some good AoE, actually. Okay, heal up. Don't break the watch. Okay, that should kill them. Oh boy. Okay, it's going to be kind of a slow stage one, but I'll ramp it up as I go. Not be surprised if there's a few deaths here. Um, I think I got a pretty good seed. I, the people I'm going against are good, but... I don't know. I, uh... I think I definitely have the most experience of everyone in here. So on paper, I should be able to qualify for winner's bracket. We'll see, though. Let me just... Kind of... Do that just in case my audio is fucked. See if that helps at all. Okay. So we're gonna grab the void cradle. And there's some chests back at the beginning I wanna grab, as well as some drones if I have the money. Say oh beautiful. Okay. Well that's a skip. I've got a whip and a safer spaces, so I'm good in that department. Let's see what's back here. I want to grab the drones. I'm going kind of slow, I know. Book of Mormon, good. Good, good, good. Book of Mormon means I can loot faster. Okay, uh, I'm going to grab this instead. Wanted that drone, but that's a little expensive for me. Fireworks. Don't know if that was worth, but I'm leaving. Okay, good start. And then I might just want to, like, hit teleporters quickly. Because I'll ha hopefully have enough with Gore's Tome. Hopefully. Is the key word. Um... Aphelion, so I don't think I'll get blood shrines here. And I think... Okay, we got scrappers. Not a lot I really want to get rid of, though. That's kind of it. Just want to heal up. Well, I'm kind of waiting for spawns here. There's a void seed. Okay. Um, and teleporters inside that. Here's what we'll do. I think I just want to hit teleporter. There's probably going to be money barrels in here. And that'll be good. And I have AoE with my Will-O-Wisp and Ukulele combo. So I'm not really worried on that front. It's a decent build. We got this. And then if they're in the teleporter. Okay. Take him out. You should die. Yep. Alright, try to stay in the teleporter as much as possible. Okay. 
kind of whiff that. Looks like the other one is down there. Hopefully he comes up and attacks me. But I should be good on money here. Okay, he should die. Okay, good. Ooh, uh, I'll take the resi disc. I'll leave it on the ground for a second though. I mean, crit is good, but resonance disc, I think is gonna help me a lot too. So, uh, this stage is looking pretty good for me, I think. I could use a healing drone of some kind. Maybe taking crit was the right play there, I don't know. We will see. Okay, interesting. It's pretty nice. Definitely not taking that. Um got a chest over here. Ooh, oh. That's good. That's really good. Okay. Do you have speed for me? Oh, I didn't mean to take that. But I think maybe it'll work out. I don't want war banners. I want speed. Like that. Okay. Um. All right. I'm liking this. I'm liking what we have here. Definitely not gonna do the arrow rain. Or the lysate cell. Hopefully I didn't miss something like super important here. Oh wait, I don't have game audio. Oops. Uh, my bad. Um, how do I... Okay, there we go. That should work. Okay, my bad. Sorry about that, guys. So sorry. Technical difficulties. Okay. Just gonna go ahead and heal up a little bit. I'm going to hit this.
Okay. Maybe did the teleporter a little prematurely here. Oh, Shatter Spleen? Okay. Okay. Maybe not then. Kind of wish I took the crit earlier, but... We're kind of chilling. We are kind of chilling. Scores Tome is carrying. Okay. Good. Okay, good. Crowdfunder would have been amazing, but... Uh, okay. I'm gonna loot up here, and then I'm just gonna try to go really fast. More Bungus. I'll come back to that, uh, thing later. I think. Grab the armor piercing. And then the scrapper. Would be nice in a second. Oh, I got a slug? Okay, good. I think I can get rid of my Bungus now. Open that. And we got a watch. Good. Okay. Scrapper back here. Get rid of this. Don't really need the war banners. Okay. Hopefully this will be good. Now I think I'm just gonna smack TP instantly again. Feeling good about this. Okay. I've got a pillar skip with my safer space. I think I can qualify. Gotta be careful. There's a Will o' the Wisp. Is Teleporter back here? Teleporter is not even back here. Okay. Fuel cell. Oh, that's beautiful. Okay. Uh, it's probably like down here. Yep. Okay. Good. Good, good, good. Another fuel cell. That's really nice.
laying into him. Guillotines do not really help me, but that's okay. Just gonna grab the fuel cell. Okay. Feeling good about this. As long as I didn't fucking miss a headset again. I should be okay. I'll leave that there for next stage. Good, and then I can get a third fuel cell here. Is there anything nearby I can just quickly grab? Okay, healing drone, sure. That's all we're getting. Good. No Z construct. That's good. Okay. Can we just hit this? Why'd I have to say no Z construct? Easy. Easy. Okay. This ocular HUD was such a blessing. I don't know if the others are going to find it. It was like in a chant shrine that was kind of hidden. I'm looking for first here. I think I can get a really solid time. Oh, yeah. This is going to be a good fight, I think. And that whip, stage one, is enough that I can skip. Just whatever Gore's Tome drops you want to give me is what I'll use. Okay. I mean, I'm like over here already. Yeah, I might as well. Perp gunner drone. Okay, I don't know if I want to take that. Honestly. Open these up. This has not been worth it so far. And I guess I'll take them. Okay. All needle tick, huh? Okay. Yo. <laughs> Yo. That's kind of dope. 
that's kind of dope. <laughs> I feel like usually that item isn't dope, but for what I have going on right now, yo, big money. Okay. I did not need to loot that much, but it's okay. Get this host skip. Oh boy. I was really hoping for a poly loot there, but so bound is pretty interesting. Okay. Beautiful. It's good. Okay. I don't even know what I would want from soup at this point. I think I'm okay. Okay, not gonna shift. Just do it one more time. Good. All right. Let's fuck this guy up. Leading there. Okay. Gonna wait on this till he jumps to the center. Get some bleed stacks in there. They should kill you. I don't have any wraps. I need to be careful. Alright, 
I just want to wait for my, uh, my thing to come back. I want my HUD. Nice if I had a little bit of bleed so I could keep these stacks up. Okay. are going to be really good here. You're going to help me reset the cooldown. Bleed stacks in there. Look at those fireworks. Beautiful. Why I duplicated my drone somehow. It's always so weird when that happens. I don't know how it works. All right. I am very happy with this time. If I don't qualify, I, I don't know, man. Like, this is a, a pretty solid, solid time for this loadout. Hopefully the audio is okay. Casters have not yelled at me, so... I assume I'm good. The fact that I haven't been pulled out, I think, bodes well for me. Oh, man. Oh, man. All right. I'm very, very happy with this run. I think the fuel cell, uh, ocular HUD strat, the shatter plane, Love to see it. Great utilization on that. I think that this ocular HUD just saved my ass. If I didn't have it, I'd be so fucked.
And then the soul bound at the end just helped me even more. Could have been a little faster, probably. Like, stage five, I didn't really need to loot. But. That's good. Good shit. Nope, yeah. They're all in Mithrix, it looks like. Hey, Disputed. Hey. You got you first. Hell yeah. You played you really, really clean. Well. Yeah. We Just were overall. scared, actually, going into Mythrix because we didn't think you had a lot of damage. Um, but honestly, it, it worked out, so. Shatter Spleen Ocular HUD. And then a last minute Soulbound yeah. to keep it up. Dude, no FMP. The, the fucking yeah, Resonance so nice. build would have been so sick. Nah, the but Shatter no, Spleen good. Ocular HUD was so yeah. good. Even I mean, if I found an missed, FMP. Like, you missed like a couple extra crit glasses, which would have been nice with the Shatter Spleen. And then yeah. there was there was an item that only one person got and you would have loved to get. Oh, uh, was there a drone man somewhere? There was. Yeah. On stage four. <laughs> that would have been nice. Shrine. I noticed right I, above yeah. teleporter, like I on the route. Duplicated my drones in phase four somehow. There's like one dead, have, but yeah. I still had it up. How does that work? Pizza. Oh, okay. It just yeah, it just happens. <laughs> yeah. Oh, can you bring Ready in? Yeah. We get Goji in as well, and do we just pull Raymond Daniels out? Or do we let him play? Uh I want everyone to play the first uh loadout. Okay. Yo, Goji and Ready. Hey, hey yo. Yeah. Goji, you broke our hearts. You yeah, know. I'm sure I did. I got nervous, <laughs> man. <laughs> You did extremely well. I, I, we really thought that you were gonna just take first, like for the entire loadout. Your build was insane. You had really good pace. Disputed did loot less and was just on better pace overall. So he ended up taking first. But you had an extremely good build. You had the crit, the shatter spleen. Saw was really good to keep up bleed. It was mm. really nice, really good. Yeah. And then Ruddy out of nowhere got Drone Man on stage four. And then yeah. <laughs> he actually caught up real time to you, Goji. Wow. And yeah. uh, I assume nobody else took plus fives. Uh, well, Dan is still in the run, and he has a single plus five. Why so. does he have a cabbage logo? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm on the the wrong one right now. It's fine. Oh yeah, Courtney's there too. Oopsie. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> it's Ray Dan's. You guys know where he is. It's fine. But yeah, Dan. I threw himself off the clip on stage three with his blink and died. So that was his death. Damn. Did anyone go all into watches? What? Dan did. I didn't even see what? that. Uh, it was where a was this? On Sky Meadow. Uh, Cabbage is probably yelling at me right now. <laughs> <laughs> Get the watch burner. Yeah, I wasn't sure if it was worth losing the crit. Yeah, I, it's a gamble, and I don't know, Dan is still kind of struggling, so. Did we all take the crit over the uh, resonance disc? No, I took the disc. I took I the know. disc. I had an ocular head. And Ruddy took the disc. Damn. Oh, man, seeing the times hurts. Oh, seeing the times <laughs> really hurts, man. <laughs> I mean, yeah, real time, Goji, you, you would be in the winner's bracket. Yeah. Which is, I mean, it, it's nice, and I'm gonna say that it's really good because that's what happened to me as well in the last loadout. That our yeah. real times were winners bracket potential, but just a couple of unfortunate mistakes. Yeah. Fuck you up. Yeah, and it's tough. I, the first mistake, I like did something that I like, like I looked the wrong way and I used the blink the wrong way, and I was like, oh, it's something to learn from. And then after the first yeah. one, my arms started like shaking. Like, I was so nervous. I was like, man, this is, I have yeah. safer spaces. I have damage. I just need to do phase three. And I was like, oh, there's a bunch of people watching, man. I'm kind of scared. Exactly. But, we were talking about that through the through the run. Like, it, it's so much stress for all the racers. And especially in a tournament where 
there's seven other people that are going up against him basically and there's hundreds of people watching like it it's tough yeah it's a yeah, lot yeah but but a really good job I, I mean honestly dan played the worst which obviously we see him finishing the fight now but you three played really good just all together yeah. really good on on times i think he was really good, good he just unfortunately had that plus five and i think of, he slowed down after that of all the runs i've done in the gauntlet races this is probably the one i'm most proud of oh yeah, wow, it was really wow. good. a low 30s arrow rain flurry default dash huntress yeah this is like the lowest I mean, dps loadout in the entire really game arrow rain is pretty good with <laughs> yeah. the spleen yeah dan took the license He's popping off what the say that's crazy <laughs> Did anybody yeah, else we do the... Oh, uh, sorry, sorry, go. No, you go, you go. I was going to say, did anybody else do the cool moon movement with the, uh, no. with the no. spaces? Oh, you were the only one? It was just you. Hell yeah. You didn't save a, a lot big of time props on that. that. Did anyone yeah. else take wings? No, you're no. the only one. Oh, so okay. your everyone play else was cool. Saw or Ocular Hood. Because you yeah. had the drone man, so you gave like, yeah. the, yeah. the drone, drone man, and equipment drone, sick. Ocular Hood. Mm. And you're like, we'll just save time and take winks, which was really, really smart. Really good play. Yeah, in hindsight, that ocular hub is probably uh, probably would have been good to pick up. <laughs> yeah, I think I had three fuel cells and a soul bound. So yeah, Ooh. yeah, that's pretty good. So it was a good call though too, because I mean there was still the shatter spoon play where you just stack up what thirty bleed stacks with a saw and then you just try to keep it up. But yeah, I don't know. There's so many fuel cells and stuff that maybe the HUD was the right play. Yeah, and I mean, who would have known we would have gotten the spleen? Yeah, exactly. And the fuel cells, so it's like, tough call. I right, can bring Dan in now. Let me do some stuff Fine. on my end real quick. Dan Hello, is deafened, Dan. but I brought him in, so. Okay, I don't know what he's doing. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> when he undeafens, just suck. everyone be silent. Let's see what he does. <laughs> but yeah, that does. decides our our winners bracket, our full winners bracket. We got disputed and ruddy being added to the the four player winners bracket, and the top two of that bracket go straight to the finals. So really big opportunities for you guys. So good luck. Are we playing next? Yeah. Yeah. Winners, Winners bracket brackets next. are up next. Yep. I'm gonna go get some water. Nice. Yeah, I need to do some editing here, so give me a second. Where is Dan? Is someone I message him. Fucking, what is he doing? <laughs> He's like, oh, they're not bringing me in. What's going on? <laughs> Fucking Dan. Uh. It's always Dan, dude. But everyone, you guys did a really good job on that one. That was really good. So from now on, by the way, uh, we're going to be speeding up the the way the loadouts are a little bit more. The, once the top there two are like for sure, like undisputed winning, um, we'll end the loadout and move on to the next one because we have a lot of loadouts today. Yeah. So makes sense. Yep. We have a lot. Cool. Yeah, I was different. My bad. Yeah. Yeah, we know. <laughs> My bad. So how was the run, just, Dan? Just sitting in my corner thinking about my watches. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I single, I single blink hosted and then had arrow rain that I didn't use to stop my momentum. Oh, so I just, you did have it. That's what I, I had saying, it. Like, I had a lysate cell. cell. Yeah, the, yeah, the lysate cell. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't even use it for like it's one I good just, I just <laughs> didn't use it. I had an absolute brain fart. I was like, oh. I'm yeah, I not think good. Not good. So, not good. Like stunned by like being thrown yeah. over the side you're like oh i my went God. so far I'm like how did i go this far what i oh so many times the blink anyway that's what i get bad play gg who won i had to go i'm assuming disputed. not me <laughs> oh dio nice yeah disputed mm. played really well nice. just really quick didn't loot too much got what he needed and played a good fight Shift off yeah, nice. Nice. And then goji played really well as well had a better build would have been around same real time as disputed, but unfortunately two plus fives during the Mythrix fight. And then that allowed uh, Ruddy yeah. with his drone man build 
that he got on oh. stage four out of a shrine. Uh, I'd like two drones uh, to pass them up. But yeah. Oh, I see. Oh my, uh, wait, what shrine? Because I got a death plant, which is equally as good out of a shrine. It stays full. No, you got it out of a chest. Was uh, it in a chest? I think it was underground, but in a chance. Yeah, Under yeah, yeah. Underground. Yeah, it was right underground at the entrance chance of the cave. Yeah. Oh, like down with the tree mates. Okay. Right. Like center of the the only one who got that, so. Yeah. Yeah. GG. Well done, Ruddy. Digo, well done. Goji. Uh, I'll see you in Mando. <laughs> yeah, I'll see you in Lucy's dog. <laughs> yeah, I'll see you guys there too, don't worry. Uh, oh, yeah, we're, we're losers, but we can be winners. So. Yeah. Yeah, I uh, I, I threw because I hate Veen. That's that's the strat. Yeah. Wait, no, you yeah. guys are the real winners because Winner's Bracket can skip a loadout, so we're actually losing out on content, and you guys mm. can get the maximum oh, amount. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we'll see you yeah, guys in right. Grand Finals. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So who's racing now? Who's next? It is going to be Cabbage, Corny, Disputed, and Ruddy, I believe. Oh, hell yeah. In top right. two there, go straight to the finals. Yep. Bypassing the next loadout. All right, I think I'm ready on my end, so uh, Cap, you're still with me. Yes. Um, go assemble the the rest of them and make sure they're ready. Assemble. Yeah. All right. Peace, y'all. Good luck. Good luck. Right, good luck, guys. Go, all right cool cool first place i'll take it i think i'm probably going to be competing with ruddy here uh for second place cabbage i think is guaranteed first on this one but uh i don't know i'm not super comfortable with void fiend so we'll see how this goes we'll see i don't know man <laughs> let's try to get a good time I mean, if I lose, I have to play Artificer, which I can probably win, or at least get top two. So, I think I'm looking good. I think I'm looking good here. You gonna start whenever you're ready? Good luck. All right, thank Catch you. Catch you on the last run. Hell yeah. Thank you, Cap. All right. Here we go. Get that. We got some money now. Um, okay. Where am I going? It's back here. Anything? Anything of note? No, not really. A whole lot of bullshit. I can get bands here, so no reason to really s stick around too long. See, I'm gonna have to go up that that way. Warhorn, that's kind of trash. Come here, guys. It's not enough. Ugh. In the money barrel. Let's see. Uh, is there anything back here? Is there like a multi shop? No. Okay. We hit this chest, and then I think we just go to teleporter. All right, good. Want to make sure I save my corruption for the fight. Okay, Topaz is not bad. Don't mind that. Focus Crystal is pretty good.
Okay. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Well, that's good. Teleport is up here. I will hit this. And I'm going to go all into speed. Good. Death mark. That's not good. I'm gonna grab more speed when I get out of here. Really not a lot of items here. <laughs> Alright, so if I get bands, got sulfur pool, and then like sirens. AoE is gonna be big for me. If I can manage to find some. <laughs> Hopefully, I don't know, there might be a chest or two down there. I'll quickly check. Be worth it. Get some extra speed here. Huh. I think I'm mainly going to be competing with Ruddy here for second place. If I had to guess. I don't think Corny's playing super well today. He's a really good racer, but... Um, just watching his last run, I'm kind of thinking, like, I don't know. He seems like he's kind of on the back foot today. I think he hasn't played in a while. And Ruddy seems like he's doing pretty good. Like, he had a really good time in the last loadout, obviously. And I think Cavage winning is just kind of a given at this point, honestly. Uh, okay, what do we got down there? Got a shrine. Bandolier. Boopy. Oh, shit. Don't want to lose the crit? Fuck. Shouldn't have picked it up. It's okay. That would have been good to have, though. And then there's a big chest down there that I completely missed. Okay. Let's look for these pot locations. One there. Not one there. Um, there's a watch. I should probably grab that. There's an opal too, though. Oh no, do I want the watch or the opal? Defense or offense? Hard to say. I think it is Void Fiend. So... I hate that button. Ugh, I hate these locations. Okay. Got the crit. There's an energy drink there. Wish I kept the other crit. There was a blood shrine. Oh, okay. So that's the pot I'm going to go for, I think. We got nice band. That's beautiful. I think we can just go, especially where there's a blood shrine. I know I can hit that. Okay.
Bop, bop, bop. Okay. Looking good. Looking real good. Oh man, I want to get a good time on this loadout. I mean, it is less content, so if I lose, I lose. But I really win, because I gotta play more. When I lose, I win. Old man... Getting his racks up. You broke, so you a hater. You don't know me. You don't know me, son. I feed the pigeons. I feed them Werther's Originals. They choke on them. They can't handle me. I'm fucking on fire right now. Bop, bop. Okay. Let's see. Hopefully I can do this pot justice. Does it easy? Does it? Shit, shit. Okay. That was bad. That location is always really hard for me. I do have an ice band though. Hopefully that'll be enough. I think I'm just gonna say fuck it with the, the pots. Good. Okay. Grab that. I got a key. So I'm just out of here, I guess. That's unfortunate. I would have liked to get bands. But I can't waste too much time on it. If I was doing a normal run, I would have taken the time to, like, really do it, but, um... Shit, I don't know. Anything I want to scrap? Get rid of Warhorn, I guess. Deathmark can go. That is good. That is very good for me. Nice. Uh, fuel cell. There's a vase. Vase could be good. Mm. 
Yeah, maybe I lead up a little bit. No. I think I just hit this. I think it admitted to going fast. No, you fuck. How the fuck did this happen? How did we get here? God damn it. They're just contributing to the void seed. Maybe I say fuck it on the void seed. I don't know. It's gonna take a lot to clear. There's only one thing in there. I think I'll just say no. I don't want to greet it. I hope not getting banned uh, doesn't fuck me here. Some stuff I think I want to scrap. Uh, I'll get rid of you. Don't necessarily need you either. I grab the vase. Kind of looking for damage equipment. I don't even have enough for the vase after this. Okay. Let's just go. We just go. I think I'm already probably behind pace. Okay, uh, I want to open the equipments. Asshole, okay. I'm 
Maybe we should have printed some fuel cells. I don't know. With a gubo, I don't know if that's like a really good call. Okay. Now I'm kind of wishing I did. There's Mocha. Looking for an octave hut here. Alright, let's see. I want to reroll this equip. Oh, was there even. No. That was my first equipment, so there's not even one up here. struggling. Just want knock their HUD. Nation tank? Okay, are there any more equipment? I can find like a gun here. That'd be really good. There's more equipment. bad. Nice. Print one of these. Okay. I already had a key, I need to do that. Did not need to do that. Pressing round printer. Ooh. That's really damn good.
Give me all your equipment. Want the HUD. Thing for me. Hunter's harpoon, stealth kit, scythe. Those are not very good. Um, I'm struggling here. Another ignition tank, but I don't have any gas. If I had gas, I'd be fine, honestly. Okay, feather, good. thing. I don't know how he's being healed. Is it a mending? Oh, there's a mending. Did he just get... Oh, he just got infected. That's not good. Okay, I'm just going to try to... Leave him alive for a minute. And Ryan. Problematic. They're fucking him up.
Okay. This kind of took a turn. Might need to loot up a little bit here. I didn't see any equipment. I know there's nothing below. This is kind of bad. I don't really want to be taking a recycler to the moon. If I have to, I have to, I guess. Hmm. Oh, there it is. Oh, that would help so much. Okay. That's really good. Here's what we'll do. We'll print a few armor piercing rounds. Good. out of here. Should've left that for a uh, reroll. Oh, I should've rerolled that. What am I doing? Yeah, that's bad. It's fine. Yeah, that could have been a poly loot. That would have been really good. Lost a little bit of speed. on that corruption meter. Here we go. Let's have a good fight. Double feather is really helpful. Oh, that was a crit. Nice.
Okay. Get in there. This behemoth was so huge. Oh boy. Okay. Get taken out. Right about now. Yo, what's up? It is over. You can DNF. Ah. Uh, GG. Okay. Yeah. You're not out yet, so it shit so far. Wanted like a damage equipment stuff. So... Yeah, because we had the speed to peel a skip, so figured it was okay. Interesting. Figured it was okay. GG's. Everyone else take the bars. For the people who saw it, yes. Disputed didn't see it, unfortunately. I saw it, um, and I didn't take right. it. Why didn't you take it? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. What you saw? Don't tell me you saw the Ukraine. I didn't see it. I didn't see it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I didn't see it. I'm going. <laughs> Let's see your bracket. So... We have Cabbage and Ruddy winning that one. Congrats, you too. And they're going to go boop straight over to the final until the captain load out. Uh, Corny and Disputed. It was a good run, actually, but you guys are going to the uh, the arty run, which is going to be after the next one we're doing here. So the next one we're going to do is the Mander loadout with Groof, or the first loser bracket one. So how would you guys feel about that run? What do you, uh, what do you think about it? Uh, was there a feather? The only thing I, I, I lack in complete safety. Yeah, I had two. Where was that? They're from rerolls. Feather was from a key box, the first key oh. box that none of you found except oh. cabbage, and then Damn. the recycler was there, and it was two rerolls for a feather actually. Hey, corny, we're the real winners here. We get more content. Yeah, true, Hell true. Yeah. I'm smadge I didn't get the recycler because I feel that was the, the dividing factor that slowed yeah, shit. That's Where fine. was the recycler? Yeah. Uh stage four. Yeah, oh. yeah, yeah. It was like away from the TP to the mm. the other coast of the map. Yeah. I'm really sad, Ruddy, that you didn't go for the AU skip with the DML. I totally forgot. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Like you, you did like a full lap around the stage. You probably could have just popped the eggs. Yeah, yeah. And it's such an easy setup. But I was like thinking, can I skip with M1 or M2? But I completely forgot yeah. about. Mhm. Mm the easiest one of them all. Yeah. Ooh. Do we GGs. know what it was? GGs. No. Very good. Damn. Cabbage yeah. fucked up his. It would skip so. I knew I screwed up stage five. I had two separate occasions where uh, void seeds would corrupt the boss, so <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> Bull rugged it. Bull rugged it, yeah. <laughs> Unfortunate. 
Alright, I'm setting up some stuff in the back end here. Uh, can someone make sure our other racers are ready? I know, Cap, you're ready. I need yeah, Dan, I'll go in there. Goji, and Waxy to be ready. I need to do some nameplate stuff here on the fly. Which is fun. Hey Scott here, what have I missed? You've missed everything, and also nothing, because we're only halfway through the event today, which is also crazy to say. True. But, uh, yeah. I hope you guys are enjoying it so far as well, as uh, players. Yeah, it's been fun. Oh, yeah. It's been definitely hype. Not looking forward to the flamethrower, no, but yeah. Why not? Design surge is better. It'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> I, know, I know. I wish you. I wish it's the return flamethrower. That shit's awesome. Oh, yeah. Honestly, true. Returns flamethrower busted, busted. Like, honestly. Oh boy. How do I enter the GUP giveaway? The GUP giveaway is at the end, and you will have to be in the Risk of Resources Twitch channel. Yes. Oh, sorry, I was not muted. Uh huh? <laughs> I mean, but, everyone needs to hear that anyway, so it doesn't matter. Giveaway is at the end of the stream. Yay. It's a giant gut bean bag. Uh, just tell them how large it is, just in case I'm uh, not familiar. It's very massive. My dogs like to fight over it, even though there's room for 75 of them on top of it. You could feed a family of four, or you could house a family of four on this gut. Oh, yeah. Easily. The gut goodness. So... Who's looking forward to what? I mean, in my case, watching some Roll Mander. I love watching some Roll Mander. Oh, is it Roll Mando? Oh, yeah, nice. it is a Roll Mando. Oh. Yeah. All right, I think I am ready on my end finally. So we're looking good. Um, is everyone, are all the racers ready? It's disputed your cast with me right now, right? Oh, I, I am? Okay. <laughs> yeah, I guess. Cool. Uh, cabbage, be gone. I'm gonna move him though. Please. All right. So, loadout four, here we go. Uh, disputed, I think you can let them know. I think they can hear me, but... We're going? I think we're going, yep. We're going. Thanks. We are going. We're going. Go. Go. We're, we're going. We're going, my good sir. Okay. Thank you. Hey. Hey. I mean, you can go if you it's want, time. but. Because they're gone. All right. It's unfortunate, but it's got to be done. What well, has to be done? We have to eliminate two people here. Oh. Yeah. And that's sad. There's only one Australian, and we have to eliminate two people. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. There's I love my Aussies. Ready later, I guess. There's always time. That's true. Okay. So. So, what do you think about this loadout? It's Roll Mando. Very close to default commando. Uh, you got the grenades. Honestly, this is one of my least favorite loadouts. The grenades are probably the best thing about this loadout. I know you like the... Um, I do. That M2, but I don't think it's very good for races. No, probably not. I think it's it's nice when you can get a lot of items and then start piercing with bands and like do a lot of stuff. But, you know, um, shotgun is also really nice. So, you know, you just go fast with it. I feel like it'd be better if physics for that were not broken in this game. When you pierce an enemy, sometimes the shot will just go upwards for no reason. Oh, did you know that um, Gorek made a fix mod for just that? 
Oh, do we have and it on? We have released it already. No, we don't have it on. We should. Not in the races. Yeah, we'll we'll actually do that probably soon. But um, yeah, if anyone has experienced that Pierce bug mod, it's it or not mod bug, but everyone has experienced that bug. It happens with. Uh, Arty Ice Spear, Commando, uh, Phase Round, anything that pierces, even Loader Punch and Merc Dash, um, you'll go through an enemy or two, and then your character model or the the hurt box of the attack or whatever, it goes straight up instead of just a continuous path forward. It's really annoying. Um, there is a fix for that. I don't know what the name of the mod is. I don't remember. Go wreck if you're around. You can post it. You're allowed. Cool. Yeah. Shout out to all the modders out there, keeping this game alive. Yeah, and thanks to all the modders involved with the uh, Risk of Resources as well. They all doing a fantastic job. So, who in the last loadout? Cabbage. Um. Okay. So Surprise. these guys got gas. First item. Cap hasn't found it yet, but he probably will. That's like ideal, I think, on Commando. Gas is exactly what you oh, want to yeah. find on stage one. It looks like there's a tent to bobble. There's two void cradles, it looks like. Um, one has a tent to bobble. Let's see what's in the other one. Ooh. Wags void is about to open it right now. I would take that. On commando. Really? I would definitely take void crit. Yeah. Okay. I mean, it's one of those builds that, like, it doesn't really do too much damage, right? So, like, if you're not really over relying on crit either for it, so... Um, it, it, later it could fuck you over if you get a Shatter Spleen. That's like the yep. main way that decision would not pay off. But, I mean, what are the chances that happens twice in one race, right? Yeah, that's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll see, we'll see. There should be a Shatter Spleen but, printer on every stage now. I don't think it's too bad, though. I mean, like, we've, we've seen plenty of runs in the loadout races where commandos just like stage four or five and commandos struggling a little bit right so especially with some like choice bosses and such like world spawns so i don't think it's necessarily too bad yeah i think it is a little early though to to really tell it's it's one of those decisions that's tough because you just got to send it one way or the other um it's not like you have the chance to get it stage three and really make that choice like oh you know this mm -hmm. is how the run feels like it's going etc you just gotta it's gotta guess essentially kind of feels that way with needle tick too yeah like it, taking it really take... really on is hard especially on a character generally, like generally though needle tick is fine though like even if you do have like full needle tick it's still not terrible it's still doing a lot of effect with your run i don't think wood crit always does it's a yeah bit harder but I definitely see where you're coming from. And I agree. It looks like Dan did it take the void tough. crit. So mm. happy at least one person went for it. We'll see how that differs from everybody else. And it might. And Gore's I'm Tome right for Cap. That's really awesome, actually. I love to see an early Gore's Tome. You can cut Reminder. like one or two minutes out of every stage just by having that oh, item. Yeah. Like, I just want to be clear for those who don't know. The teleporter event enemies actually give you less gold um, than non-teleporter event enemies. So when you start the teleporter, you're actually earning a lot less money. And it comes out to about, like, half as much money earned. Because I think they give you, like, way less money than that, but they spawn more often. Yeah, it's like 73% so nice or something. Yeah. yeah. Um, even it out. You want to be a nerd? So... It's a little bit rough, right? But with a Gorse Stone, Gorse Stone drops full amount every time, regardless if you're in a teleporter or not. So that's a lot of extra gold for just doing what you're supposed to be doing anyway. A teleporter or just fighting against that stuff. Mm -hmm. So it's not that bad. Economy items are super important, and the earlier you get them, the better. Like, had they found that oh, stage yeah, four, yeah. it wouldn't have really done anything. But here, it's really going to have a big payoff. I mean, I mean, we were talking about, talking about last time he was in here. here. It's like, like, especially, especially when you go into a strategy that's like needing it a little more, more early on. on. And then, and then yeah, yeah, that's like, like full, full time save as, as opposed to if, if you're not really going to be a leader anyway. Oh, oh, also, we saw um, Aqua here again.
Pot rolling map. We'll see how it goes. So, disputed the pot rolling last time in your run. Yeah. I didn't like yeah. either of those locations. I think the other one wasn't too bad, though. I think the, the one you were trying was way worse. I, I think it wouldn't have been too bad if you did the other one. I think you got messed up, though, because you spent all the time on the flower, and you're like, ah, I got to go fast now because I wasted three minutes. Yeah. Stage three was where, like, a lot of the magic happened, too, with the, the builds and stuff, which was, like, yeah, it was tough. Yeah, I think I misplayed that. I, I just wanted to get pots. And I wanted to get bands. I already had one band from one of the chests, but... Mm hmm It was funny. Ruddy and Cabbage actually got the one band and then just skipped getting the bands. Uh, Corny was the one who actually went out and got the bands as well. Interesting. Yeah. And Corny also lost, so... <laughs> Not the right <laughs> strat, apparently. Yo, Quail from the yeah. Teleporter. I Very love that good. on Commando. Quails are amazing in the I race. like it better with the slide, though. Everything's better with the slide. With, with roll, yeah. It's so painful after coming back from Risk of Rain Returns, though, and seeing Roll as, like, the worst ability in this game by far. Uh, because Roll in Risk of Rain Returns is actually really good because you get iframes, and it's re like you can dodge anything. Uh, in this game, it, you don't get iframes. It slows you down from just running speed because it doesn't scale with sprint speed or sprint speed cans or anything. Um, so... It's usually better to not actually roll. Hmm. Unless you're like falling to your death. Yeah. Usually. So. It's a fall damage cancel. And it is slightly easier to pillar skip. Uh, when you're like on the little branch and you have to roll up. It's kind of nice. Yeah. But beyond that, slide is superior in basically every way. It's tough. It's tough. Hope these guys get some good pot locations here. It's like everyone... That's the best you can hope for. I mean, this is a character you like. It's kind of tough because oh, there's an AP yeah. player on stage two as well on Cap's screen. But it's kind of tough because on one hand you're like, okay, Commando has no real damage here. Um, I kind of want bands, but then you're kind of thinking like, do I want to get bands if I can't use them that well? So like, there's definitely some back and forth here. I. I do think it's the right call because I'm assuming they're going to all try to get an equipment that does damage and try to get like a band proc and equipment. Is yeah. Like their goal. There's a band right next to TP as well and a chest. It's like the chest closest to oh, the Oh, nice. TP. There's also a scrapper like here. So these guys can get a bunch of APRs. Oh, Dan threw away his gas for the APR, which is really mm. good. That might cost them a little bit. I crammed it. There's literally a scrapper right next to it. So. Dude, remember? Oh man, oh. <laughs> the, he did this last time in the uh, in the multi loadout. Like it was a, it was like touching the ATG printer, and he didn't see. It. What printer is that tough. next to Dan there? I don't know. I just looked up and I missed it. Okay, it looks like Calf and Goji are doing the teleporter. Right call, honestly. They have Gore's Tome. They should be able to loot. And it's this map doesn't have as much loot as the other stage two variants because of bands. So the credit value yep. is a little bit lower. So you have to keep that in but mind. But honestly, when it's still like way OP. And a shuriken as like, the teleporter item. Oh my. So now they're definitely going to get bands, I think. Yeah. I mean, now that they have such a very strong band proccer. I mean, it's not like consistent. I say very strong. It's very consistent. Yeah. Grenades aren't consistent. Um, not as consistent. No. Especially like the later you go and there's just more flying enemies, it's tough. Yeah, and it's just like you have a lot of control when you throw a grenade into a group of enemies. It's like you don't know what you're gonna hit. You don't know which is. Yeah. Not to say that shurikens are perfectly accurate. Goji is scaring me a little bit. Please don't die, Goji. Uh, the brooch on Goji actually saved them a little bit there. I don't know if it was like between life or death, but it definitely saved uh, their morale. Yeah, because uh, they were For really sure. low. Brooch is, uh, okay. I think, slept on a little bit. I think so. Early stages, it can be used a lot, and especially if you have like two brooches, you can actually get like full barrier very easily with just like a gas. It keeps you alive, and it keeps you charging that teleporter. 
when you don't have mm -hmm. healing and you feel like you have to leave and come back, that's never good. Interesting. And Dan gets punished with a uh, ignition tank after he gives up the gas. So th oh. there's kind of an interesting decision there. There's a repulsion armor and an opal in a multi shop. Hmm. What would you have gone with? Uh, I hmm. They're both important, I think... but probably wrap because I can get through a run without opal, but I find I really struggle if I don't have at least one wrap. Interesting. I would have gone the other way. I think wrap is better for teleporter events. I think opal is better for like Mithrix and uh, obviously it's better for the big hits, but, but like phase two is really rough there. if you don't have repulsion, um, like That's burns true. and bleeds and like Titan laser which Dan is dealing with right now. It helps with that a lot. They're both very important, though. I think you can make an argument for either one. Agreed. As long as they get one of the two and not the mystery third option. <laughs> yeah. They're fine. And you got pennies it's now? It's really tough for Dan here because Dan doesn't have the AoE anymore, so he's actually having to lead away the enemies in some kind of like pseudo-cope state right now just to fight the boss. And he's actually using the uh, phase round to pierce through that group as it walks forward back to the TP. So not bad, but now it's just how simple a one gas loss can be so magnified. Yeah. I mean, AoE is super important, especially on a character like Commando. Not having mm -hmm. to click M1 on every single enemy is just going to be so good for you. But speaking of rap, uh, there was pennies next to the teleporter. And Goji can really utilize that. He has two, I'm noticing. Uh, he scrapped his pennies, never mind. But uh, okay. <laughs> that that's really powerful. If you get burned by something, it, you can basically oh, just yeah. loot the entire map. It's so and good. there's a lot of blaze enemies on this stage. But also, like, really wanting that, uh, that AP round now that you can just get it. So That's true. And they do have Gore's Tomes, so they have a little bit of economy, but... Man, I just like uh, gushing about roll of pennies. We know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a shill. Every time that you pick it up in a in a race, we're like, oh, there he goes. Like, <laughs> you always seem to find it too. I don't know how you find it every time. I sniff them out. There's pennies on a, on a stage smell, I know. Dude. Yeah. <laughs> Who's gonna be the first one to leave here? I actually don't know. I don't... Oh, and there's a syringe printer, actually, that Cap is going to as well. Looks Ooh. like Cap is going in his usual half and half. Smart. Classic. Honestly, really good, especially I... with um, potential bleed coming up, too. I hope he finds the ignition tank. It's right next to teleporter. Ignition he tank, I think... He something else out of it, I oh, think. Did he? Ignition tank makes it, such a big ignition difference. Tank... Ignition tank was the oh. question mark. There's a vase. In the multi-shop oh. on stage three. Okay. Well, that's really good. <laughs> oh, everyone finds that. Yeah. It finds it. <laughs> I looked at it like four times, yeah. and I was just like, I don't need this. <laughs> I don't know why. I, yeah, I mean, you needed it, clearly, but... <laughs> I wish you picked it up. I thought you just didn't find it because I thought you were just going too fast at <laughs> stage. I appreciate you giving Honestly. me the benefit of the doubt. No, I'm just yeah, an idiot. Well, never again. <laughs> stage three looking good. This is actually um, just almost my favorite setup for stages, actually. I love Scorch Shakers here. There's a lot of multi shot variants for like equipment and stuff, so you can pretty much get what you want usually when you're here. And. Um, Best bosses, they have a potential for Shatter Spleen, Little Disciple, and then next stage they have also potential for Molten Perforator, Shatter Spleen, and a lot of credits on that map too. Mm -hmm. So they have really good potential on this run for looting a lot and getting a lot of good stuff. It looks like uh, Dan and Wax here are kind of synced up, and it looks like Goji and Cap are a little bit synced up in their runs. It's kind of like this, this little pattern on my screen. There are so many equipment multi shop here. Cap getting the vase. I mean, they almost have a, a full build here. Yeah. I'd say Goji is looking the best, honestly. Cap did go half and half with the wrap and the attack speed, but the attack speed doesn't increase band damage. And the wrap does. Oh, there's a capacitor here, too. 
APR. And a gun. Oh, if there's a gun, they need to get the gun because they can get Shatter Spleen, dude. Because the boss. Where's the gun? Uh, It's in the middle. Okay. It's next to Goji. Oh, yeah, I see it. It's next to Goji, yeah. Cap's going to wow. find it afterwards. Cap going a little bit too fast missed out on a full Shatter Spleen, especially when he printed syringes already. Okay. That's um, tough. Yeah, remember earlier when I said there's no way there's going to be a Shatter Spleen? <laughs> yeah. Well... well. Don't I look like an asshole? Dan already is the only one with the Brit to you, so. And there we go, Goji actually picking up the gun. Beautiful, Goji. Good. I love that. And he's already got a little bit this of crit is, too. And Goji already has crit. Yeah, like this is amazing. I really wish Goji found a little bit of um, syringe, right? Like even one would have been kind of nice here, but it's okay. Like he does. He has this one. This is still perfectly fine. Oh, never mind. I think yeah. was there a predatory printer last <laughs> stage? I feel like that. I feel like there was, and they just didn't go into it. But I could be completely wrong. There's a band as the teleporter item. I don't know what that green one was. Cap there is a regen scrap that Goji just found. Okay, so Cap not getting the Shatter Spleen sucks, but he does have a vase, and he has a lot of bands here. Yep. If he just goes fast, I mean, he can potential. definitely win. I think if the others loot up too much this stage and get too much of this stuff it's going to be kind of rough for them goji getting the wungus out of the uh void cradle on the other side of the map really actually good that's the kind of healing i think they needed or they're yeah. looking for they had the drone but they needed something more reliable here definitely i don't know i think goji's looking really good here i think they just need to go to tp though yeah. That's what I'm looking for. They have the gun. Shoot the boss, and uh, they're good. I think they can just I rush Mithrix. It's still better to loot up a little bit more, though, because they still need some amount of movement speed or, like, defense for Mithrix. Um, mm -hmm. And their damage isn't totally there yet, even with the Shatter Swain, but it's close. Yeah, that's true. And they do have a Tenta, so that'll help a little bit. And there we go, Goji. Really happy to see that Shatter Spleen. That is really good. I and, wonder how many of the others are actually going to go for it. And it's the teleporter. You see the gun. So he's going to be rewarded with another band, well. too. Oh, Scythe is nice. Yeah. If he had a Shatter Spleen. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, okay. They might. He might be able to get it next stage. We'll see. The good news is, though, is everyone knows the vase is on the map. Uh, if someone doesn't have the vase, they've seen it. Uh, Cap actually picking up the capacitor instead for a band build. Did you say that already? I don't recall if you did. Uh, I wondered if he would. Itch, I don't know. Maybe that is the good play in this position. Like, if he finds safer spaces, I'd say that might make sense. But he doesn't really have a lot of speed, so it is going to take a while to get over to the host skip spot. Yep. And he, like... Actually, I don't even think he has enough speed to skip right now. He needs a little bit more. Not yet. Cat picking up his Gortone drop and leaving the stage on the stage four for him. So let's see what stage four is kind of looking like here. Very interesting. There's a Void Cradle right off the start as well. Uh, a Bungus printer, which isn't great, but for those of the people who got Wungus, which is everybody. I guess they could get a little more healing if they feel like it's necessary. I don't think they will, though. I think they want to keep as many white items as they can for damage. But... Yeah. I'd be looking for, like, a Feather, so, Safer Spaces, Opal, Speed. Like just kind yeah, of defensive stuff of right that. now. Looks like Waxy is going for the gun as well, which is beautiful. So we'll see. Uh, the two racers on the bottom half of the screen are going to get Shatter Splane. The two racers up top are not going to have it, so... And I think we're going to see Dan struggle here a bit. Losing that gas on stage two was a pretty Not big misplay. Not only losing the gas, but picking up the Vrit, which is losing out on the Shatter Spleen, yeah. is also really rough for AoE. Like, that's double the loss of it. Shatter Spleen is AoE. That's tough. Yep. I think it's more of an AoE item than a single target item for most characters, anyway. Yeah, definitely. But, uh, like, stage 3 is kind of the breaking point with area of effect, where you can get through it, but then once you get to stage 4 and you don't have any area of effect items, you're kind of screwed, and you'll have to cope a bit. 
then it gets even worse it on was stage already five. coping stage two a little bit right yeah like the teleporter it wasn't like a huge cope but it was like he had to step away from all the enemies which is losing teleporter charge time Cat oh there's a gas printer on stage four and there's a gas printer next to a soulbound that just popped out of a chest oh, on nice. stage four. Do not tempt me like this. Okay. <laughs> there's two more void cradles as well. Stage four is packed full of void items. So it looks like Dan will have a recovery solution for AoE going forward as well. Mm. If there is an FMP and there is one fuel cell, that's enough for a really good FMP build, actually. Because they have the... Uh, they have the ignition tank. They'll have the gas. I don't know. I mean, I'm looking at Dan, too, because he doesn't have the Shadow Spin or anything, right? Yeah. Um, yeah, it could be good. Hmm. Potentially. Koji has a really good build right now. I love Koji's build. I wish they had found the... Uh, oh, there's a speed printer. ...on the side of Stage 3, though. Oh. Cap okay. lost his gas, but... Uh, there's a gas printer. It's fine. There is a gas printer. I wonder printer. if there is a scrapper on the stage. There's an ATG right on spawn that Goji just found too that no one else has oh, found beautiful. yet. Beautiful. Looking at Cat, basically. This is such a good run, actually. Yeah, this is exactly this is really what you want to see. Hmm. And a Murph from the teleporter. Oh my god. And that's just a natural drop. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Again, having that ignition tank would be really good. I'm surprised more people didn't take it. It was a random one. Oh, it was a random. They okay. They didn't know it was there. Yeah, yeah. I didn't register. No, they. It was like Shorm something else, and then a random, and they, uh, the two people who took the random gun. What I mean is. Also, again, really good for Goji because Goji is going to have the Ignition Murph along with the Shatter Swing, yeah. along with the ATG, along with the AP rounds. like And the base. Really good stuff happening here. You know Goji's happy to see that one. Yeah. I, if I were Goji, I wouldn't even look at Stage 5. I'd just go straight to Mythrix. I would scan around for the tri shops for a feather, I think. Yeah, feather would be good. Maybe open a few void cradles if you see him. Yeah. He, he sees the speed printer, like, I think. It's right next to him. You really don't have to spend a long time. Oh, no! And the heartbreaking oh. plus five from Goji, man. It was delayed on my screen. I'm like, uh oh, what happened? Who died? Goji! <laughs> that is rough. Um, they stood in front of the mending bell and just took a chunk out of them. That is really rough. But that I, hurts me on so many levels. If anybody can come back from this, though, it's Goji. It is Goji. They have the build. They they just have to have a good mental here, That's which is the hard part. And there's a polyloot in one of the void cradles right next to TP as well. Like, wow. Dan is for sure going to struggle. Cap doesn't have a skip. Um... Waxy is actually looking pretty good. He just got a poly loot. Oh man. And then he got that soul bound. The poly loot uh shatter screen play is really good. Oh yeah. Looks like he just found it. And with the ATG and the Murph, you got a good proc chain build going. Mm-hmm. You got a sticky bomb in there and too. Cat is opening this void crit on the other side of the map that I wanted to see. Oh, it's a light safe. Nah, no one's taking that. I think Cap's looking <laughs> for safer look. spaces. He is, for sure. Oh, another uke for his poly loot that he hasn't found yet. He will find it. Yeah. Eventually. Goji getting the soul down. I mean, no one's going to leave this age with, like, gas from the gas printer, though. So the build for the soul down FMP is not really going to gonna fly. Yeah. Unfortunately. Maybe another day, my friend. There's way better options. Opal from a shrine. That would really help Goji here. Mm hmm I Can mean, that would have saved them, I yeah. think, from that bell. Rejecting that Opal earlier for the wrap. It's so tough, dude.
Oh man, Goji is is no. Oh, the squid polyp. The squid polyp. Oh. Oh no. They actually <laughs> lived. That Goji stopped moving because they were like, "I'm dead. This is it." And they actually got the collapse hit and didn't die from it. And they're like, "Oh my god!" And then they started moving. Again. Why did they not die there? It, the base damage from whenever they got hit by just wasn't enough. Okay. Yeah. And they are going for the speed because, I mean, like, look at how slow they are. <laughs> yeah. This is Wow. Crazy. Losing the gas isn't that big of a deal anymore either because they have the Murph, so. And the Spleen. And the Shire Spleen. Yeah. yeah. But losing the crit would suck. Oh, Goji needs to be really careful with these crabs, dude. Yeah, I stopped printing. Please. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. <laughs> He's fine. Oh man. Uh, Cap okay. on stage five, looking kind of good. Do you see now, us in that though, multi shot? With that... No. But Goji having the plus five? I don't know. This is. I don't know who's in the lead. I don't know who's far behind. It's really hard to tell. It's so hard They're to all say. All kind of around the same point though. Like Cap um, is the furthest ahead, but he doesn't have a skip either. He doesn't have the ATG from last stage either. So, is that another soul bound? <laughs> the chest. Wow, there's been a lot today. Uh, I think I found one in one of my runs too. Yeah, I really wanted the FMP build on that one as well, but it just didn't happen. <laughs> uh, there's mm. an ignition tank in this one that Cap is taking, which is good because the Murph actually between the Tensile Bobble and the Molten Perforator for Mythrix, it actually can work. Uh, usually with uh, Molten Perforator on Mythrix, he kind of just dodges out of the way of it. It's really slow, but if you can just freeze Mythrix in place, suddenly it's it's actually pretty good. So yeah, a lot of value there. If they get another Chrono Bobble to add into the Tenda Bobble stack, that would be really nice as well. There's also a Scythe in that multi shop. That could be a good play for Goji here. Maybe. Kind of hard to say on that one though. I mean, he already has, or they already have an ignition tank. And reminder, chat room. The bottom two players on this loadout are out of the tournament today. So this is like, there's a lot riding on not losing here for these yeah. guys. Yeah, I honestly don't know. It's rare that you get to stage five and you don't know who's going to win. But this one, I'm, I'm at a loss. <laughs> Hopefully they all do well and have fun. Smile. Oh, there is a uke printer on stage five. Okay. Dan just pinged it. Okay. Well, it's on the outer I, ring. I mean, he's the first one to see it. Dan could potentially win here. I mean, all you need is that. I'd go all in to honestly, that, honestly. Yeah, Dan doesn't need the uh, the bands either. I would like to keep the ATG. Um, so if there is a scrapper nearby, I'd I'd try to keep it. But like, you can get so many, and especially like looking at someone's build like Goji's, right? who has the Spleen or even Waxy, mm -hmm. uh, that would be insane. I'm surprised he only got the one. Like, having 10 well, Polymutes, the, uh, you just win. Scrap. I think he's just waiting for Scrapper, maybe. I don't know. I don't think there's really anything you could lose there that would not be worth it. Shrug. I mean, uh, Polymute procking off of an ATG would be kind of crazy. It would be, but, like, that versus... 10 polyboots all the time and you don't want to take the time to, mean, to scrap either there's no way he's not going into it to be clear i just think he's he's waiting a little, a little bit yeah. i hope that's the case and it seems like he's the only one that found it but he definitely had the confidence like okay i see it i'm gonna go hit teleporter i don't think cap has seen it yep. Grown man out of the legendary chest that Waxy just Oh, got. okay. Can, can this be a turnaround here? Dude, if there's a gun on stage five and Waxy finds wait, and kills the... Wait, There wait, are cores. It's empathy cores. There are from, cores. It's from, from the, the telly. boss. It's actually just from the teleporter. Oh, Waxy. You need oh, to go, my man. <laughs> he doesn't know that he needs to go, but he needs to go now. Wow. Really? That gamble on the legendary chest paying off for him, maybe. Now I, I really know. don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> I, I don't. The Drone Man Empathy Core build at the 11th hour. Holy shit. 
I think Waxley just saw the speed printer at the end. I don't know if he saw it there before. It's, there's a card on the stage as well, which I don't think they need. That's kind of a little bit of a bait item here, probably. I want to pay attention to what Cap is seeing on this map. There's another ATG as well in the multi shop up top. And a feather. Oh, Cap, don't do it. Take the feather. Oh, no. All right. He took the ATG for an extra bit of damage there. Um, and he's just leaving. I would have taken the feather and just gone in all into Polyloose, probably. And he's going to have to do pillars now. Unless yeah. there's maybe a headset. But even then, that's going to be way slower than just using the vase. Cap has to be really confident in his movement here. Um, he does have a just a couple of movement speed items on a quail with roll. So it's not like it's going to be easy for him. It's going to be a little bit tough. And Dan is... It looks like he's coping a little bit. He's not standing inside the teleporter a whole lot. Uh, he's got to be a little bit careful. Looking at Waxy, I need Waxy to print that uke. I need Waxy to hit TP, and I need Waxy to get that Emily Core build. I think he's going to loot run a lot more because he's scared about the no speed, honestly. Yeah. Um, which is kind of scary. He already has so many drones, too. Oh, man. I think he's also almost like... I mean, is a good play, but I think Waxy is looking around for a possibility of a gun as well for the Emily Core's... Um, which does make sense. Yeah. There is a scrapper on stage five as well. I don't think really anyone is going to see it or go into it, but it's there. Oh, what is this seed? Right. Wow. I don't know. Dude. It's like every time. <laughs> Cap doing pillars. It looks like he's going for a soul pillar first. He's okay. having a really hard time killing a perfected elite, so... We'll see how successful his soul player attempts are. I would have rather he just gone for design or something, um, but we'll see. Goji's if he on has the moon. a good soul pillar here, it's worth it. If he doesn't have a good soul pillar here, it's not worth it. So that's the gamble. He's trying to go for the high roll. Hmm. I don't know. I'm kind of looking at Dan now. He's the only really? one that I think knows about the poly loot printer here. No one else found it. That's the craziest thing, actually. It was just on the outside. They just had to walk left, and no one did it. Oh, but man. I, I want to see him go into it. Anything that happened in the middle of the because... Wax, he's doing the teleporter now, though, and he's going to have some cores here. So if Wax or yeah. if Dan takes too long... Oh, I don't know. If Waxy is comfortable enough to leave like pretty much immediately with that build... Um, I don't know. Cap is trying we'll to do his second pillar. It seems like these soul pillars have been kind of slow for him. This one is pretty good, though, because the enemies spawn on the other side of the little, uh, the wall. So this one's pretty free. I think that's why he probably went over to this one. Um, because he's like, you know what? We can just get the free one in the back and maybe just gamble for the other one next to it. Waxy's about to find it. Waxy's about to get it right now. And I want to see his face when he sees it. Once he sees that, oh, yeah. I don't imagine oh, he's yeah. going to continue to loot. Yeah. Oh, I don't know. And, and Dan is still looting. Getting some uh, sticky bombs from the, uh, the whatever, the soulbound. Wait. Koji didn't pick up all of their um, sticky bombs. They actually left one on the ground. They only picked up two. Oops. Oops. I think Goji's going to finish first real time, but I'm actually looking at Waxy here. If Waxy leaves. If Waxy doesn't yeah. leave, then we... Yeah. Cap is starting the fight, Cap? but yep. if Waxy goes immediately, I think he'll be able to overtake him. He does have the vase, too. He can get right in there. And Dan did not go into the polyloot printer at all. Why? I don't know. Whatever. We're moving on. <laughs> <laughs> it's. I don't even think Dan has a uh, a banned build besides his like shurikens, you know. So. Huh. Man. Oh. We'll man. have to ask about that.
Cap is having a decent fight. He does have a good capacitor band build here. And Goji is melting Mithrix as well. Goji has that plus five, though. And I think really it's really going to cost them. Listen, though. I mean, Cap doesn't even have a feather in this fight. Like, the possibility of Cap dying here is very high. It's not like Goji's totally out yet. That's very true. Dan doing what he does best on the moon, staying around waiting for Vase to proc. Yeah, he used it at the beginning, and some, right, like I don't know. Sometimes it's faster to do that and then just wait it out, and then other times on it's your faster to just speed. run. Oh, and Waxy did immediately go. Nice. And he's got a fuel cell, right. so he can get up there pretty yeah. quick. Coming out of nowhere. Love to see it. There we go. The legendary really chest paid off in a big way this run. And it never does, you know? Like, it's always, like, absolute trash every time, and it takes a long time to get. It's like, damn. But Goji's the first one on the phase two. He's about to... And they're about to enter phase three, which is good. Um, Dan actually doing a lot of damage. A lot more than I guess I thought he would, but he does have the extra pilot. Yeah. I, I want to see Waxy's damage. Here I we do, go. too. This, this is going to be, be a lot. It's not going to like instant kill Mithrix, but it's going to be a lot of like heavy. De Look, oh my god, it's free. Are, are, are his cores up? Yeah. There they yeah, are. Yeah, they're here, they're here. Oh. Holy hell, he's got to be careful of Mithrix, though. So. Yep, you just got to survive. I, dude, this is so close. They're all like basically within a phase of each other on Mithrix right now. And I have no idea who's going to win. Obviously, Goji has a plus five, but like any of them could plus five here easily. Oh, man. This and reminder, so the bottom two of this loadout are getting chopped. And the top two are going on to the second loser's round. So, And phase two will go really fast for him as well. The cores oh, absolutely yeah. melt the adds. Everyone's just got to focus up. Oh, man. Goji on phase three. Oh. I'm ready. Cap is done with phase two. Waxy starting phase two. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Goji is in the middle of the right now. Dealing with this uh, golem. Trying, trying to get, get some. some... Okay, okay, just, just get it out, get out of the way. way. I'm going to say maybe, maybe, maybe it's going to sound like a like shadow or something. Uh, or something, or something but... This phase two is so going so up. fast for Waxy. Waxy. He's, he's already he's already, already phase phase three. Three. Oh man, dude, Amber the core drone man. There's nothing else never to say fails. About it. Never fails. That's why you always try to go for it, everyone. <laughs> Goji is doing really well in their pizza. Oh, they're getting flanked by some ads here. Okay, they lived through another wave of it. Oh man. Waxy's about Dan to overtake is, Cap. Uh, starting phase three right now as well. They're all in phase three. All of them. Oh, man. This is so close. Oh, it's another plus five for Goji. I don't know what happened. That's rough, though. That might be the uh, nail in the coffin. I think for, so, unfortunately. On this one. Having someone else or two other people get two plus fives each just to stay in. Oh, um, this is so close between Waxy and Cap. Dude. It might come down to a phase four skip. Which would be harder might, for Waxy because the drones will just kill it, him. Dude, it might come down to Cap not having the vase to get to the ship faster. Oh, that's true. Right? Like it Oh, Cap does phase four skip yeah. here. And Waxy doesn't. Okay. It depends. Oh, dude, if Waxy has a tough time in phase four here, he can actually die. Yeah, the cores. Because of the empathy cores. Oh no. And uh, Cass has a lot of speed, good. but he just needs to get second, right? Good job yeah, to Cap. I to honestly, I didn't good think job, Cap was going to win this one. But... Oh no, he's got to be careful. He does have ATGs, I think. Waxy does, so oh. he's got to be really mindful. And Mythers is shooting a lot of the ads right now. Uh oh, he's getting prickled a little. Looks bit. like his Don't cores by that shuriken. are distracting the other cores. Uh-huh. He's got to orb phase, which is really good. 
Dan almost done. Dan might go for a phase four skip right here as well. So we'll have to see. Dan not getting the phase four skip. Oh no. Waxy getting hit by an orb. The other cores are coming for him now. He needs to start running with the vase. Move. He needs to use the vase. He's using it. He might get hit by an orb. He's really low to the ground. Okay. Dan just really going for the phase four damage right now, trying not to get hit by an empty core. It, it goes, it's between Dan and Waxy. Whichever one finishes first is going to be the first one, and they're going to get to the next loadout. Oh, but Waxy finishes. He needs to get out, though. Yeah. Oh, but Dan is a little bit uh, different on his clock because he started oh, you're a little right. later. I don't know. I don't know. I think Dan is actually going to get ahead of Waxy and get into the next loadout, dude. Oh, no. And Waxy's struggling with That's this. That's crazy. Because Waxy did not get the phase four skip and he spent so long on that. Oh my god. Yeah, look at they're so synced up right now. We'll have to see the end time, uh, just to be sure. That's the only way we're gonna be able to find out. But dude. Ugh. I I have no idea. You wanna bring, bring Cap in Cap. here? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey. Hey, congratulations. It it's going pretty damn good. I was I was happy with that run. This and run you did actually had some really shit good. in it. <laughs> did it? Man. Oh, yeah. <laughs> We're waiting right now for a frame, like, win. Who gets in oh, the next God. loadout? Yeah, so, because we have, like, load time stuff in here with the time, so I need to actually see oh, the shit. end clock sent to the website to see who's The real time was getting. crazy here. Yeah. <laughs> We're all there. Mm -hmm. uh, we're, we're all there. But Capacitor was the best. Well, oh, it wasn't. Goji as well. It was the Drone Man <laughs> Empathy Cores, but you started oh, the fight okay. way sooner. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus, man. <laughs> and everyone is out. Bring in all of them, please. I'm busy. Okay. Oh, my God. You're okay. No. Yep. Welcome. Hey. Hey. Welcome in. Oh, um. I'm oh, waiting on the right. website to tell me who actually got into the, the next loadout and who got what? eliminated. What? <laughs> really? Wait, wait Ooh, we're all finished it. at the same time? Yeah, wait, it wasn't yes. me, right? Cap is for sure in. No, Goji. Cap for sure won. Sorry. We're waiting on second. Everyone give a, a, a GG wow. Goji clap in chat, though, because they oh, played it very well, regardless. I'm sorry, um, but you were the first one eliminated out today. I hope uh, it was fun. It was. And he did was. well. It was really... Like, you were in such the lead so Oof. far in, and it was that bell that took you out. It was painful. It looks like Dan scrapes the head of Waxy. Oh, uh, oh, 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 where was the drone? All right, now man? it's embarrassing. All right, Jesus. Yeah, so where was the drone man? <laughs> In the legendary chest. Oh, oh okay. Oh, wow. I, that's like, yeah. That's not okay. even cool. Okay. I didn't spend uh, enough. I mean, I just got everything else. Now, uh, there's some controversy. <laughs> there, there was a polyloot printer on stage five. Dan was the only one that saw it. What the fuck? And he did not go yeah. into it, really. Oh. I saw, I saw the, the uh, I saw the ukulele <laughs> printer. I didn't want to lose my bands. <laughs> and, uh... At I don't know, man. Oh, I, I don't know. I, <laughs> I doubt myself so much in races, man. <laughs> like, yeah, that's crazy. I, I, I am like, I'm so confident that I watch Cabbage play. I'm like, this guy is stupid, but he's why is he winning all the time? <laughs> why is he winning? I did pillars, by the way. <laughs> what? Wait, yeah. what? Yeah, Cap went you didn't yeah. a lot faster. I got the capacitor. And he still went faster? Yeah, capacitor. Yeah, the capacitor bands. The yeah, bands just, and the capacity you just That is your build, and then I, I, yeah, I just went. I tried ah. to be as efficient as possible. Tried to find a pillar skip, but if I was just quick enough, I was able to outpace you guys. And I mean, I barely. Really but I, was, I thought I was going TB to TB. I mean, I did loot a little bit on stage four, uh, four because of that legendary chest. I had enough money for it, and I was right next to it. I was just like, "Fuck it, I'm gonna go mm, for it." Waxy, it yeah, came down soulbound too to the phase four skip. Dan got a phase four skip, and you <gasps> didn't. Oh, I, I, didn't I didn't get phase four skip. I didn't get phase four skip. I didn't get it. During, didn't. during oh. that last slice of pizza, I was oh, like, okay. okay, my drones are gonna fucking kill him. I'm not gonna be able to phase four skip. I was like, I accepted yeah. my fate at that point because the drones. 
Okay, the, the real the real moment that I was like from the get go, I was like, I'm on the back foot. Did anyone lose their gas to the no, AP ramp with you. the scrapper I, I, right I next it. to it? Yeah, yeah that's I crazy. <laughs> oh, you no. did too. Yeah, I crammed it big time. I went over um, like I like oh I have three white items. I risk one gas straight away. I went over the hump. There was a two scrappers. Two. I was filthy yeah, the entire time. Not a single of AOE the rest of the run. All right. Yeah, I was okay. Good. Was Nobody did bounds, right? Yeah, that was a fine one. Yeah. Oh. Uh, nice. Right, we well, had the I'm shuriken for the TP, so it was like... A, a reason yeah. for two seconds? The shuriken yeah. for the TP was really just like, okay, I, I need to just get these bands in. It was mm -hmm. a pretty easy spot. It was just the kickflip up the slanted. Oh, can someone tell plate? K he's up when he's casting? Because all of my backup nice. casters are playing in one uh, <laughs> right now. <laughs> it happened. Wait, so who's, in the, next, who's in the next one? Uh, it's going to be Cap, Dan, Corny, and Dispute. Okay. All right. Ooh. The OGs. Uh, shit. Waxy and Goji, you guys played well, um, but you guys are the yeah, eliminated. So. Oh. Really close right. real time oh. on that Mando run, which is crazy. Yeah. All right. Well, I had fun. Yeah. Thanks for having me. Peace out. Good job, guys. Yeah, guys. GG's. GG's. Oh what fuck! What am I looking for right now? I have to play flamethrower already now. Yeah. Looking forward to it. <laughs> Can we just play blight? <laughs> yeah. Can we please do right. blight now? Is that me? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> In your like most despair moment, <laughs> begging for blight accurate. <laughs> <laughs> We've had some rough ones recently. Uh, yeah. <laughs> We'll see how this goes. As long as, I mean, the main thing here, same with the last one, if you could just stay consistent, you have a good chance of getting first or second, but shit, Waxy was right there. That was very close last loadout. Mm hmm. You missing the gun the two on downs? stage three was really yeah, sad. Yeah, that was sad. <laughs> Even there, I was like, if I find a capacitor, I'll just take that and leave as quick as possible. And it was down there. So I was like, oh, I guess I have to do it now. <laughs> so I really wanted that capacitor. That's what I did. I really did. But like, yeah. I've yelled was... myself so many times when taking the vase. Yeah. It was just so comfy. Just yeah, knowing just, that you'll yeah. have damage. And then I got the yeah. soulbound on. What was the first soulbound? Hey, soulbound. First soulbound was on no, I got one. No, I got and one on second. Five. Yeah, second was on, this, on Sky Meadow. Yeah. yeah you need so I had two there, soul yeah. bounds getting through pillars with capacitor. Like, all right. Not too bad. Chilling. Oh, yeah, two salt. Yeah. Nice. All right. We've hit long at all. Nice. Mm. Good shit, though. Man. Really close times. Man, if I did, I reckon I could have won that if I didn't print my gas because I spent two of my TPs. I had to kill a boss after the TP was finished charging. Ah. Uh, so I couldn't yeah. kill anything. <laughs> it was rough. I, rough. I think if you just yeah. went into the poly loot printer, you'd have. Had yeah, so yeah, much damage. Should have more. You had so the Tenta too. Oh, like on the other I side of the teleporter, like around the yeah. outside ring. Ah, the ring that's not there sometimes. Mm. But like, and I had my ATG and my Shuriken, my bands and stuff. Like, I don't know. I don't feel like your bands yeah, are really doing anything compared to the value of the, yeah. the poly loot. So yeah, if you just better. did that and you didn't loot that map, I think you would have been okay. Yeah, well, I don't know. I'm still into Flamethrower well, yeah. Arty, so yeah, good luck. <laughs> My favorite. Did uh, <laughs> someone right. tell K? He's up. Or... No. No. Can someone I'll jump in. <laughs> okay. okay. Then the cast. Do I cast? Yeah. Do I cast? You cast. Okay. Aaron. Yep. All right. Um. It happened. So it's gonna be yeah. It fucking happened somehow. So it's gonna be <laughs> cap. Dan, Corny, and Disputed. Um, K. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's so funny. We had like backup You're casters right, prepared. They're yeah. all racing. <laughs> yeah. oh, one yeah. constellation. Somehow you managed to yeah. get the wrong constellation. No, at the back, yeah. I've got I, the real dregs. Sorry, chat. No, can, we, can we start fast, please? So I, I like, yes, I yes. actually. Yeah, well, I'll just do I'm a probably. 20 minute time. And yeah, and then that, that's yeah, fine. Moving. That's fine. You can. Yeah, yeah. I need good. one second before we can start. 
please. No, that's hold right. on. Oh, this okay. is like it's, this it's, is like, old, like we'll be waiting in the dungeon. We'll be waiting in the dungeon. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. This is like Gen One, like <laughs> after it's, we had this big discussion one. about the generations were. Yeah, yeah, yeah we had a one now, risk of resources. OG racers right now. Gen yes, One just kind of as alpha racer. We we coined that alpha racers. Cap and and Grub yeah. are alpha. Then ever right. since we. <laughs> Like, since January, like, we haven't missed a week since January. Everyone who was there at the start is Gen 1. Limu, Cabbage, and uh, me are Gen 2. And everyone after is Gen... a uh, new Gen. Yeah. New That's gen. what we decided. The I'll new Gen. No, you decide new That's Gen. That's pretty good. Yeah, yeah you got Alpha. alpha. And that's, yeah, you're that's the only one who's later, active and Alpha. Moved to alpha. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm an Alpha, so... <clears throat> what the fuck is Anyways, happening? Yeah. I am, like, not even listening <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's fine. I mean, we need to, we need to, uh, yeah, talk something, right? I guess you need to wait Dude, a this, minute. I'm this back. already loaded. Oh, so we got ice. Oh. You get I mean, it. So the good play now is yeah. looking for a uh, play of ignition tanks, right? Ignition tank. I'm looking for a feather. I don't care about yeah. that shit. I know. It's pretty free to be oh, honest. You, you should also have thirty. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> so can we get a gamba on like <laughs> who's gonna be the first person to panic flamethrower? And I think it's Iron Surge. That's okay. gonna happen. I, I would never do that. And a heart to spot, right? <laughs> 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 I mean, if I'm surrounded by like five wisps and I press uh, flamethrower, it's not intentional. <laughs> it's not intentional. Yeah, surely. It, we'll. I'll definitely talk about it once it happens. Okay, but maybe not make it a gamble. It'll, it'll Otherwise, happen. people are gonna be mad on on whatever decision we take. Yes, yeah, true. <laughs> true. <laughs> All right, yeah. I'm saying the thing, Kay. I think we are good to start. Thanks for being patient on me. Great. Okay. Good luck. Good luck. You guys good luck. go and play. Good luck. Good luck. Okay. Here we go. <sighs> Lane thrower Artie, huh? I've not been doing well with Artie recently, but Artie's one of my most played survivors. I'm pretty confident with this loadout. Okay. We're gonna loot the first couple stages pretty heavily. I think. Ah, man. Okay. Man, a lot of uh, classic racers today. I've been racing with Cap, Corny, and Dan for a very long time. It's kind of cool. We're all playing Flamethrower Artie. Best loadout in the game. Look at this colossal damage. Holy shit. Okay. What do we got? What do we got? Mountain Shrine, that's bait. Mocha, not bad. I see a crowbar back there. We do not have pot rolling. Bop. Okay. Um. If I start teleporter, will I have enough? I don't know. I have healing and a little bit of speed. Grab that real quick. And we'll uh, do the teleporter, and I think I will assess afterward. Not a bad teleporter spot. We really juke this guy here.
Ow. Nice. What do we got? Go loop. Maybe you should have held off on picking that up. There's a cloak chest up there. It's kind of out of the way though. Is there a big chest? I thought there was a big chest back here, but maybe I was wrong. I think I just saw the printer, I guess. Grab that. We'll get out of here. Oh wait, there was... Chest near the beginning, wasn't there? I don't, I don't have enough. That's sad. There's like a single enemy I could have gotten it. Okay. Alright. Playing for first or second here. We can't plus five. I don't think I plus fived at all today. Kind of happy about that. Let me just like... Make sure that's good. Okay. Hmm. What am I doing here? This crowbar is really nice. I want to get some more economy items. It's 36. Um, topaz. Or repulsion armor. Repulsion armor is really good. And if I find pennies, it serves a dual purpose. I think I'll grab that. Hmm. Ooh, there's a drink printer. Okay, never mind. I wish I hadn't gotten the wrap. Is there a scrapper? I don't know. But I do know that I need to go into this. I have a healing drone, so I should be fine. Yeah, of course it takes the wrap. I was hoping I could maybe keep it, but... Maybe I can keep the crowbar. Nope. <laughs> Don't know why I think I would be able to. Uh, Rose Buckler? Maybe. I'll probably have to do pillars. I think I want to see what else there is to offer. A random. See, I can move around really fast here. That's nice. Oh, and I got my wrap back. Good. Um, okay. I really just want, like, bands here. Are there any cool multi shops I can grab? Excuse me. Playing Ring Around with the Rosie with this. Fucking golem. Alright. Gross. Uh, 
Ugh. I really don't like going into shrines. That one was okay. Okay, I want to get enough to buy... Was there a chest back here? I thought there was. The squid pop, okay. I think I can just do the telly, hopefully. Don't really have damage, but... Do you have speed? Got the focus crystal. Hopefully this will work out. need to die. No, fuck. I didn't want you to kill my drones. by that drone. Where is it? There we go. Okay. We got the double bloop. It's interesting. Shuriken. Hmm, how should I, like, is there a way I can use this gloop to my advantage? Without dying? Just, like, kind of take fall damage and then let it do its thing. I need to rebuy the drone, actually. Healing drone is very important. So I'm going to buy that and then we'll see where we are. Hmm. Can't get the prion. There's Bungus.
Kind of a bad run. Where's my healing drone? Come here, buddy. Which is that? 129. Need some AoE. Oh, beautiful. Get me up. Elixir. Ice and steak mocha. Roll of pennies anywhere. Hmm. Hmm. Good. Um, still just looking for area of effect damage. Jade Elephant. I gotta start this. Ugh, I'm going really slow. Magma Worm is good. Don't take out my healing drone, please. Bandolier. This it's not good.
Get out of here. Oh, man. Hmm. I need a better equipment. I feel like I probably missed something here, like up top. I gotta go faster. Just, uh, just sucks when I literally have no area of effect damage. Try these 219. Like a uke, will o wisp, gasoline, anything. Anything will help. I can go for an ally worship unit, skip here, and try for one. Oh, good. Now, if I can just get a uke to go along with that. Good. Good, good, good. Okay. You need to go. Good. Okay, this is going kind of slow. I need to see what's in this void. I think, is this a Void Reaver?
open these, I guess. Good. Oh, good. Good. Okay, we go. We go. We go. We go. Beautiful. There's a void seed here. I don't like that. Do we have a grandpa anywhere that I can abuse? Maybe I gloop. This boss was like worst case scenario. I just don't have a AoE, but I should have damage for Mithrix, I think. Oh my god. Yes. Yes, Papa. Okay. 
Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna wait. There's stompers there. Wish I found that beforehand, but what are you gonna do about it? That's actually kind of bad, because now I know they're going to have a skip. Alright, just focus, just focus, just focus. Just focus. We have snoppers. We have snoppers. Lot of speed, that's okay. Just get to the stomp re spot. I do have a lot of speed, actually. I'm fine. Oh, I, are Stompers even a skip on, on Artie? I don't know that they are, but my wings are almost back. I think you can't have a feather because you get the weird like hover. It's okay. Make it in one. Please tell me I can. It's fine. Didn't lose that much time there. Should have printed backup mags earlier.
No, 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 no. Okay, okay. Uh, fine, I have an elixir. I'm misplaying. Get rid of these guys. There we go. I need to stop resetting pizza here. Ah, shit. I tried. Okay. Yeah, backup mags would have been really good here. Oh, why'd I use that? Why'd I use that? Shit. Shouldn't have used it. What a waste. Yeah, oh my god. Now I really need it. It's gonna be a low 40 probably. Could have been a sub 40. Haven't been pulled out yet. It's a good sign. Why'd I use wings there? 
kind of a stressful fight. I didn't plus five at all. Okay. I maybe should have used Gloop more. I kind of had a hard time in phase two. And I don't know, maybe I'm the only one that found a skip. I don't know. I feel like you can skip with headset, but the feather makes it so weird on Artie. Because normally what you do is you hold space. But when you do that with Artie, you just hover. So I don't know. It's kind of weird. But I did find the wings, so... I was alright in the end. Feather helped. I can see people dying on stage 5. That was a pretty rough one. The grace of God put head stompers in the teleporter. <laughs> Okay. Nobody's been pulled out yet. Oh, I think I'm first one done. Oh, thank God. To get to yeah. the ship and Cap can use this chrysalis. Yeah, true. There's that as well. But he also just Actually, has so I much think damage. Cap is faster. Cap is faster right now. Oh, no, no, he only... needs to end this first phase? Okay. Uh, let's bring in the speed. Hey. How'd I do? And K is out. So it's just me and you, Speed. What up? How did Congrats, I do? Congrats, by the way. You won. Yes! You won. Oh, that head stomper in the stage 5 teleporter. The grace of God. I know. Holy shit. That I'm... was like the thing. You excited about going to the final loadout? Yeah. Huh. <sighs> Cap is in wing prison right now. Yeah, that um... happened to me? I swear to you. There is a moment I'm like, no. oh, I'm dead now. Cap greeted, and he should have just gone for the, the step up there, and he could have gotten a head stomp, and then he just wasted all that time. Cap needs to kill Mithras within a couple minutes to catch up to Dan and actually beat him to the final. Um, so that was really not good. Cap has a lot of damage here, though, so we'll see. It could happen. Corny, unfortunately, dying again. Corny didn't get the pillar skip because he didn't get um, wings and he couldn't do the headset skip very well in Artie so he had to do pillars and he died on him which is really unfortunate man K clocked out so quickly <laughs> dude he has a class <laughs> now oh like, okay yeah he wasn't even supposed to like be here man that was a, a tough one no AOE really oh. All Cap has to do is phase four, and if he can do it quickly enough, um, he can actually beat Dan. Oh, this is really close. He has to just not mess up this phase. If he does it really well, and he stays up with his damage and everything, then it'll be good. If not, then this could be rough. Tensely watching. What up, Dan? Oh, good day. That might beat you right now, which means you might not go in the finals, but we'll see. What was happening? I've got complete radio. in phase four. Yeah. He's Those... using the colossal damage of flamethrower. And there we go. I think, I think that was enough. We'll see if how he does if he gets yeah, to the ship. I was like ship, forty-five though, or something, wasn't I? No good portals. 46-32. 46 46 Ugh, yeah, easy. But oh, he has GG. wings here. Yeah. Holy this shit. This is good. Wow, really scraped by. So, how was your run, Dan? I mean, you died. So. I got blasted by those bells. Holy hell. <laughs> I pressed my gelatin too, and it was, wasn't enough. It just, uh, I don't know if I There's hit it the frame damage. that it hit me. I don't know, but yeah. he does... Like, they went off, but like, I still just... I feel like I only got hit by one, and it did all my health. So, I got was like a frame off hitting the Jellifant, I'm not sure, but yeah. It was fine. The bands are good. All the mobility came at the end with the Stomper's Feather, right next to the Stage 5 TP. Mm -hmm. Can you skip with Stomper's Feather on Artie? It's weird with yeah. the Feather. Dan yeah, it is weird. 
if I didn't have enough speed to be able to counteract a god awful <laughs> acceleration, I wouldn't have been able to. Oh, you just did it in like the safer spaces spot. Yeah, but like I only just just skipped by without hitting my head on top of the TP. On top oh, of the stage. Nice. I found wings. Like just. And that was, was with like an six issue. energy drinks and a red whip, which is insane. Jeez. But uh yeah, it doesn't work. The feather messes you up with Artie. Oh, that was a stressful one. No AoE, like the entirety of that run. I know. Well, like, that's been my last two runs. I've had no AoE periods. So yeah. That one will wisp, um, I guess. Can someone go in and tell Corny he's off the hook? For sure. Hey. Hey. Hey, okay. you? Uh, you can concede. Yeah, thank you. So you threw? Is that what you're saying? Yeah, I, I plus five. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. It was actually really close, uh, Cap. Even though he plus fived, uh, you were like a minute away from him. So Shit. You barely scraped in. Yeah, I hey, feel Corey, like I was... How's it going? Yo, I feel like I was struggling through those early stages. No, you were. It's kind of rough. <laughs> wow. It was brutal. Flying though, Artie. Yeah, I got uh, I got blasted by the bells. I started stage three TP mm. and turned back myself. I used the Jellyphant just a second too late, and I got the fucking blasted. <laughs> just instant. Yeah. I was really trying my hardest not to die. I've died. I glooped like five times that run. Dude, I don't know uh, how you didn't die, actually. <laughs> I don't know either. <laughs> you got to like under uh, 10 health like three times on stage four, <laughs> to be clear. So. Yeah. 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 Um, was, was there anything that we missed, or is it disputed really. just a god gamer? It was just tough. Yeah. He's the, Everyone he's got the stompers at the end. The head yeah. stompers were so nice. Yeah, dude. Shit. The gift from the heavens. <laughs> um, mm -hmm. Gents, is there something that I have done wrong once again with the host skip, or are you not? Like, you are allowed to do it with the feather, or not? That one is uh, tricky. There's a setup no. for it where you have to hold space. So you have to use your feather and then you have to hold space right before you spawn back at the top or else you'll get your feather back and then... Yeah. But with Artie, yeah. it's weird because right. you have the hover. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So you have to yeah. time it. That one, I think Waxy has a, a clip of it. Maybe you can study Shit. that one. There's like, yeah. a, there's like a shadow you can use to judge when to hold space. Oh, that one, that was tricky. I don't know on that, Corny. I found wings on stage four. Yeah. That's what oh, I did too. Much better, much better. Yeah. Yeah, I wasn't saying about you, Corny, but I spent to the normal safer space spot and did it. And just did it there. Nice. So. But yeah, yeah, it's weird. Yeah, with gotta practice. Party. Gotta practice. We out. It's fine. GG, oh, gents. Oh, GG, guys. Out. Well done. That was scary. Going through and that one. And you're passing with me, I think. By the way, so you're not leaving right, for the cool final. Beans. The finals. Yes, yes. Oh yeah. yeah. Like, final. is there? Is there no one else? Like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's been banished to the Shadow Realms. <laughs> um, let's see. So for the final, it's going to be Cabbage, Ruddy, Shit. Disputed, and Cap. So I need to mm. set up the thing for that. But uh, can someone go to make sure that they're ready? Also, can we get a GG clap for Dan and Corny? You guys did great. It was obviously just a yes. tough one, um, but it was really well a played really both far. of you. So. It was it was close all the way through for everybody. Jeej. So Jeej. really well done. Oh dear, those bells, man. <laughs> what have to be bell? I'll get you. They were scary. Uh, like, we didn't really have too much or er, AoE. Yeah. Well. That, I reckon that was my issue. Too. Yeah. Yeah. I, I, yeah, I, if you could have like a hit hit marker, it was directly between my eyes. Like it hit me fair <laughs> square in the head. <laughs> Fucking blasted. <laughs> Damn. And that was stage three. Yeah, yeah. But uh, the rest went well. Dude, I, mm. I don't know how I didn't die stage five, man. Trying to do that TP with no AoE? Jesus. You didn't pick up the stompers uh, before? No, not oh, till like you... after. Yeah, I, <laughs> like, oh, I didn't get them till after yeah. either. Yeah. It would have helped. So I got the stompers yeah, and then I flew too high up twice in a row. So I wasn't able to actually stomp the Z constructs until my second wing came up. Like so. Icarus. Um, he was like, I flew too close yeah. to the sun. <laughs> yep. Dude, true. <laughs>
All right, let's take down yeah. the uh, take down the cabbage, I guess. Yes, we'll <laughs> yes. take out the cabbage. That's yeah. the goal for today. The final it? boss. Yeah. The little red gremlin in the corner. <laughs> I am almost set up here. Um, and they're ready. Cabbage and Ruddy are ready. Ruddy has the world record for the gauntlet category, by the way, so... Oh, for Captain. True. 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 <laughs> yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah, we'll see. And Disputed can't speed shoot. So, uh... I mean, kind of no, free. Not a spooter. <laughs> not a spooter. Don't say it like His that. His hands are too frail. That's the arthritis. <laughs> sure. Yeah. No, Cabbage was saying he had some, like, binds he uses. I want to, like, try to figure that out. I know like for Barney his switches or like, his oh, binds, binds when he plays right. Captain. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He, like, wrapped his hands in, like, cotton wool or something, like, binded his hands. Why can't I pop out my chair? <laughs> Good shit disputed, though. We're in the finals, dude. Yeah, man. Twice in a row for you. Dude, I got beat by Digo twice today. God damn. I got dang. <laughs> Speed of dominating. Did. Yeah, that's how you I know did. you're doing poorly. No. <laughs> Stop. That's what I meant. But... <laughs> All right. Now I just need to set up the stuff. The actual stream link. So everyone's, like, you guys got your timings down, right? Like, I don't know. Surely you got your timings for your Dabo strike ready to rock and roll. Yeah, I yeah. think so. Were you saying something? Are you no. talking to me right now? No, sorry. <laughs> I was out of line. Sorry, my bad. Yeah, you weren't spoken to first, so. Yeah, my bad. <laughs> sorry. All Maybe right, so. Maybe sock to talk. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> Jesus, <laughs> that's like the second Harry Potter reference you made me in a week. Still like Harry Potter. The first one was good though. Anyways, it was. <laughs> this is the final loadout of today, chat room. After this loadout, we will be giving away a mask gup as well. So, oh. uh, it's a gut bean bag. What else to say about it other than it's huge? So, Massive. yeah. Hold on, I want to make sure I have the, the right link thing here. I'm going to go to my like... gamer hole, so let me know. Yeah. Also, if, like, an American wins this, like, the odds are you're going to get this beanbag for I... All right. Captain, huh? I mean, bands are free. This is going to be a really quick loadout. I can't speed shoot, dude. I think it's just like a bum rush everything because this one's for all the beans, right? So, bum rush, stage one, get bands, and then I just hope I get speed. Hope I get a skip. That's a strat. I know Cabbage is going to go fast. Ruddy has the world record. So, yeah, we'll see how that goes. <laughs> Oh boy. Hey boy. It's been a fun one today though. <laughs> been a fun one. I'm happy I got to the finals again. I was worried I would like eat shit twice in a row and I've won two loadouts. Pretty happy with that. One two out of the three I played. <sighs> I'm just waiting for him to tell me when to go. They're still setting up. Cabbage is the man to beat. If I can, like, medal again, like, if I get third place again, that's what I got in the last tournament, I'll be happy. Just have to beat one person. But yeah, I, I feel like I've been, uh, I've been on my shit today. I haven't died at all. The morale is pretty good going into this last loadout and again guys we're giving away a gup after this so uh, make sure when this run is over to go head over to risk of resources on twitch and you can enter to win a gup 
Like, this is one of the last ones that's going to be given away by the community. So, definitely uh, get in on that before they're gone. Hopefully, they'll sell them at some point. I don't know. They might not. Animals love them. My little, my little cucarachas love the gup. It's their favorite. Ah, oh, man. I'm stressed. I want them to tell me. Oh, okay. I think Dan is telling us. He's going to come in here in a second. You good? Roger that. Yeah, okay, love you. Bye. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, they fixed the Captain Beacon bug, too. It's nice. It's a nice little touch. Okay. I'm gonna do this. Okay. All right. Well, that's a skip. Um, <laughs> all right. <laughs> Uh, that's something. Wow, okay. Gonna grab that, I guess. Uh, probably should got the speed. I gotta go for the slug there. I guess, well, it is safer here. Yeah, speed would have been better. It's a misplay. here interesting first item very interesting Hit this. Nice. Okay, I'm not gonna take fall damage. I have vertical mobility. I just have to go. Hmm. Don't misplay this, man. Okay. I honestly don't even want drones because I think it's going to fuck me up. Later on. In phase three, if you, like, have drones, it makes timing with Diablo a little bit harder. Okay. This is so good. Mocha, nice. Can't get that. It's fine. Okay. We're going to get bands here. All right, here we go.
that down. We just hit the teleporter. Nice. Okay. We could just hit this. There's equipment down there. It's pretty nice. Nice. Leeching seed. Don't really like that, but it's fine. I think bands will be worth it. Route. Interesting. My heart is fucking racing. Know where it is. Here we go. Shit, dude. Head stompers make this so stressful. Okay. Okay. Attack speed. We're gonna grab bands and then we're gonna get the fuck out of here. We're just gonna keep running. Once for all the beans, so let's get the fuck out of here. I took the other speed. Can't buy anything. 
I don't need anything. I'm really just fine on items. Wings or something would be nice, though. Okay. Fucking go, dude. Just gotta book it. Want to be out of the next stage by like 13. not gonna get the prion yeah i don't have time I'm gonna buy that guess i need to do some stompies good Got here. A crit. Tesla coil is crazy. Oh my god. What is this run? Let me get that adaptive for a vase or something. Turn up my music a little bit. And I think I have geysers that I can use on the next map too. And on five, obviously, I'll have some geysers, so I should be okay on AoE. Yes. Oh my god, yes. Holy shit. I'm the fucking best. I'm the fucking best. Fastest reaction time west of the Mississippi. Holy shit. That's so good. Yeah, baby. We fucking go. Repulsion armor, I want some. I 
desperately want some repulsion armor. Okay, where is TP? Down here. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Then maybe I can use that geyser to my benefit. Not sure. Yo, I got a left in Daisy. I want to print some wraps. Don't want to lose more speed, but if I have to, I have to. I worry about phase two. I think I got a good shot here. That's not helpful. It's incredibly not helpful. Oh, there, there are whips. Oh, fuck, I don't want to lose that. I'll take it. Okay. Didn't lose my healing. It's fine. Make sure I'm keeping the slug.
Nice. What do we have? Harpoon. Hey, dude. That's fucked up. Don't target me. What did I do? Shouldn't have gone over there. I just pissed him off. Nice. Oh, nice. That's so good. Okay. I don't know if it's faster, but I think I'm just going to run. Kind of low on heels. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oops. That was not good. That's an oopsie poopsie. Shit. I got too close. Okay, we'll just do this. Not centered well. Shit. I'm fucking up.
Good. Shit. playing this fight. Beautiful. Okay. I kind of fucked up in phase one and two, but phase three went pretty well. Oh my god. Good run. Good fucking shit. Holy mama. 
I feel really good about this run. I feel really fucking good about this one. Maybe Cabbage beat me, maybe Rudy beat me, but I feel like... This is damn good. That base out of the adaptive. What the fuck? <laughs> no plus fives. No, like, really big time losses. Except, I, I guess, phase one and two were scary. Phase one was a pretty big time loss. But, other than that... I feel like I played this run to near perfection. Oh, careful. Was it enough? Oh boy. No, it wasn't. I think I lost. It wasn't for that. No. Oh my god, I'm last. It felt so good though. What the fuck did they do? This one looks like dead for me, so. Cabbage, you were very impressive to watch our way through. That was very clean. Which is the one moment, but it was so clean after that. Oh, 20 yeah. seconds, isn't it? I beat Cabbage. Yeah, hey, Roddy, GG, Roddy, you were hella close. G? Fuck. Yeah. Mm. 20 seconds? 20 Someone seconds. came down. Oh my yeah. god, I did not know it was that close. Mm -hmm. And don't go anywhere, oh. everybody, because we have a gut. <laughs> what do you mean, no, don't go anywhere? Well, you so. gonna pull me in? Hell. Yeah, a cup of beans yeah. for this for you guys. I mean, that's that is the gamble, and you do it well. Wait, it's like if sure. there's nothing good that you miss, to then you really? win. But on stage, oh uh, yeah, maybe yeah. even with a death, I don't know. Eh. I thought I, I I thought I had a chance even with a death if there wasn't like stompers or anything. If you went for another, if you got the double skip after that, I think you yeah. would have been uh, close. But yeah. Those people took yeah. a lot of time in. Okay, so what happened? GG, Did I just fuck up in phase one and then that cost me? Yeah, that was it. That was yeah. it. Yeah. What happened in phase one? I looked up and your Diablo was on the ramp. Yeah, but well, I like went too far into the arena because I like vased um, in and then it launched me too far. Yeah. Oh, there was a vase. Yeah, that. It... Uh, oh, out really? of the adaptive chest. Uh, oh, I'm a gamer. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I'm not a gamer. I skipped it. that one. Nice. Yeah, I was looking for quail so bad. Oh, yeah. That's all I wanted. Yeah, absolutely. Ooh. That was one of the uh, GG, craziest, Kat. like, well final... Like, not only Dude. was it just a crazy run, it was, like, the craziest, like, final two. It was so <laughs> insane. Yeah. Honestly, My Mithrix okay. fight was so clean, I will say. First of all, before Holy we do the shit. giveaway, um, obviously, congrats to Cap. Congrats to Ruddy, and congrats Thank to Dispute and Cabbage for, like, getting this far playing well congrats to everyone today uh you know corny waxy goji um everyone did really well all right um and dan of course you're here but you know. <laughs> dan <laughs> and dan <laughs> um everyone everyone was playing out of their mind it was a very very fun tournament to watch all the way through but it's time it's time for the gut giveaway all what you guys wanted so we got to figure out a keyword for this one what do we want what do you think <laughs> what could it be what could it be i don't know i mean i'm I joking think... it's gup right <laughs> yeah we'll just do gup everyone spam gup to enter in the giveaway uh we'll roll it in about uh i don't know we'll give you a couple minutes to enter and to make sure in. that you're in so i'm entering i'm in you can't fucking enter that's cheating <laughs> i haven't got mine yet i'm salty i want another one you greedy bastard yeah i entered what what a... yeah <laughs> <laughs> I'm I, Andrew. dude echo needs a second one all right now i, sure, I mean just put two, to me, two I together is the bed i won't I, allow I, myself I, to win but i just think funny. it'd be funny if it did roll me 
I mean, yeah. it would be cool to have two. Then you could pretend you had one big gup and you cut it in half. You got two other gups. I mean, that's okay. yeah. Don't for scale, for the scale, you want to go. It's about the. It's not exactly the size of a gup in game. It's maybe the size of a geep. Like the level two, mm. I would say. It's four and a half feet in diameter, so uh... the size of a geep. <laughs> yes, exactly. Mm -hmm. Oh, guys, uh, you have to do it in risk of resources, chat. It will not work <laughs> if you do it in here. <laughs> Bunch of idiots. <laughs> YouTube chat is different, man. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're special. <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to make sure that everyone gets a chance and an opportunity to enter in before we start. <laughs> we only have about 600 of you guys entered in, so there's a lot more people here than that. But I do yeah. want to say also, um, if you, you need to really think about the gut, all right, because it's really big. <laughs> and if you can't have it in your house because it's literally too big, let someone else win it. All right. That's just, it is fine. a house, though. I mean, you could live in it. You could live in it. You actually. could live in it. Yeah. Like, I could sleep in this thing forever. Like, it's crazy. It's so big. <laughs> this is also like, there's only a few of these gut bean bags made, um, ever. So, th this is it. This is like, you know, yeah, do we know? They're not, they're not. They're not like mass producing these, are they? No, there were only mm. a few made, and that's it. Oh hell! We yeah. know that so, for sure. That's cool. They're yeah. not later gonna make more. I mean, maybe in a year from now, they're like, hey, that was kind of cool, and they, people liked them. Yeah, but we get the first gen gups. I'll get some geeps yeah. or something. Yeah, the alpha gups. <laughs> the gop. <laughs> the gop, dude. It's time. I'll give you guys like two more minutes, all right? Type in gup if you want to enter in. There's still a lot of names that have not entered. And I feel bad because I know there's a lot of people who are like either asleep or like they're AFK or something, but you know. And also, um, I'm going to PM you on Twitch when you win. Make sure you have PMs open, okay? Also, type in chat when you win. I'm going to say your name. Type in chat when you win, so I know you're here. Um, yeah. And then you're going to give me your email, your working real email, so I could give it to Gearbox <laughs> and they can hook you up with the gut, okay? That's how it's going to work. So. But yeah, honestly, amazing day today. Uh, I can go over some announcements and stuff while we're waiting for people to enter in the giveaway. Um, if you wanted to see more of these, uh, you can follow the channel, but the best place to see when the next one's going to be is by joining the Discord. So discord.gg slash risk of resources. It's below our page right now under the stream, or you can type in that link and you'll get there. Um, we have a mod. You can play this mod with your friends. Just search up risk of resources on the mod page. We have a, a real speedrun.com uh, category. It's the gauntlet category. We have, um, most of it. We have a YouTube at risk of resource. If you want to see some older runs, older loadout races, and if you want to apply to be a racer yourself, go to riskofresources.com slash rules. Holy yeah. shit, you could be here with us. We yeah, beat my cat. Be a uh, if you, you apply to be a racer, get smacked by Cap himself. So join the Cap today. Smack. Oh yeah. <laughs> if you uh, apply smack. to be a racer and we you think you're good enough. <laughs> Uh, we'll, or like have potential, like yada yada, whatever. We'll allow you into the training wheels program so you can scrim with all the guys here. And um, that's like a really good entrance into it as well. It's helped a lot of them. Like Ruddy's been scrimming a lot with them and he got second in the in the big tournament. So. Yeah, dude, 20 yeah, seconds on winning the entire tournament? Holy. Hey. I've lost my all number right. one Australian spot. I just got shit on. <laughs> Yeah, you were Isn't never number one, even when you were the only Australian, so... <laughs> the only one. God. <laughs> <laughs> Brutal. <laughs> Actually painful. All right. Are we ready? I'll give you, like, a, a 20 second countdown. Spam dude. gup chat. Get in. Last chance. Put in Don't miss I'm doing it again. Double. I want double. But also, thank you, chat, for um, just being here for the tournament today. It was awesome. And we don't usually do tournaments it's because it's really hard to schedule that many people uh, in one day, but it worked out and it was awesome. So 
All right, 10 seconds and we'll roll it. And we're there. And as always, we do this every single week, so we'll see you guys next week for the next one. Dude, I'm tired. All right. Up some Out of 800 people that have entered in. Oh, boy. Here we go. Don't tell me it's dance slow. Please don't be me. <laughs> the, the winner is... The Igeen. Uh, oh, thank God. Speak up in chat GG. now, dude. Raise your hand. GG clap for the winner. What was the name of that again? I am adding them in chat. The Igeen. Oh, Are they in chat? Did you spot that? How did you spot that? How did you spot the... that? I don't know how you read this. Yeah, I found him too. All right, in <laughs> chat, do you, do you want the gup? Say yes or no. In like capital letters so we can see it. <laughs> yeah. Like... Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Did I see them? I'm, I'm like, inside us now. I'm like lent in squinting at the chat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Put the gamer hunch on. Oh, I no. might have said it, might have missed it. Yeah. Oh, oh I, I saw him. Happy about that. All right, there they are. There they are. They're good. Okay. They're, they're good. Are. They're keen. Nice. All right. <laughs> well, GG, GG Chad. GG Thanks for being here, everybody. Game. Thanks for everyone um, for being involved today. As always, go follow all the streamers involved, from Cabbage Corny to Cap to Waxy Disputed to Ready to Goji and Dan. K was here for a little bit too. Um, go follow them all. They're great. But GG everybody. And thanks for. Thanks for watching another awesome series. I'll message you right now about the gup, and we'll get that sorted. We'll see you next week, chat. Goodbye. Have a good one. Bye. 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 Mm -mm. All right. Uh, that's all for today. Pretty happy with my performance, honestly. Um, third place. I beat Cabbage. Uh, I thought I think I did pretty well today. I won two runs. I think the captain run didn't do quite as well, but I, it was close. I was like within a minute or two. So I'm feeling pretty good about that. Didn't die at all. It was not an embarrassment. So that's good. Um, I'm probably going to be streaming some Risk of Rain returns later tonight, maybe like an hour or two. So uh, look out for that. But I do need to go eat attend to my facilities all that stuff um and i'll catch you guys later thanks for hanging out guys